The sun is setting on another day in Fallout 76. So it's a nice day for you to like the stream. <laughs> Subscribing's great. Consider becoming channel member. Channel member. The Patreon option. There's a Discord if you want to get the stream alerts and an Amazon store affiliate link. If you grab anything on Amazon, use the link. I don't know why we're back in Fallout 76, but I thought with the Fallout TV show that we should probably do something Fallouty. I don't know why specifically, but maybe to enjoy the magic of Fallout. And I was like, Fallout 4, that doesn't make sense. That one's, uh, oh wow, I'm a good shot. You know, it's getting its current gen or its next gen update at the end of the month, so we'll be visiting that one again. And Fallout 3, you know, it's older, Fallout New Vegas older. And I was like, uh, let's have a nice chill, let it roll Fallout 76 night. But we start at the homestead, because it's it's kind of fun. We should probably make, like, an expeditions team, though, I'm thinking. And then we can do expeditions, so... Team. Create new team. Is there an expeditions team we can join? A level 31. Is there, like, a, a higher level expeditions team we can join? That's level 116 and 381. Okay, so that's Jedi Birdman, which sounds pretty cool, but what is Jedi Birdman doing? Are there any, like, tasks that are actually doing? Sunshine. Defend Sunshine Industrial. I mean, we could go do that, I guess. I'm just trying to see what Birdman is, is up to, you know what I mean? Because I'd, I'd like to go do expeditions. But, like, if these guys are doing something cool, I'd, uh... I wouldn't mind being a part of that. I can't even see them. Are they, like, inside a building or something? Yeah, I, I, I don't even see these guys. The Rose Room. So that's what these guys are doing. Yeah, it doesn't even look like they're on the map doing anything. Okay, I'm just gonna create an expeditions team. And see if anybody joins. And then I'm gonna ride this hot dog. Time to ride the Pippadel. That's what I'm talking about. Uh, yeah, last time was pretty rough, but we're not doing story stuff this time, so it's gotta be good. We should look for Phil Spencer. Was that like a Reddit post? Someone's like, it's Phil Spencer. Just like, okay, that's cool. Yeah, I, I liked Lucy the best. I thought she was the coolest character. And I guess, like, light Fallout TV show chatter just because it released, but I don't think it'll spoil anything. I need to sit in my chair and readjust things. I'm just like... I don't know how to describe it, but I've, I've been in my chair for so long, it's like memory foam now, and it's like, I don't know if this is the best seating arrangement for my posture, <laughs> basically. So I've been trying to correct it, and it's like super awkward. Because I think I'm supposed to be sitting kind of like this, to be honest. And now I'm just, yeah. Anyways, we're gonna, we're gonna rock this. What does plus Fallout TV mean? Well, I'll just, yeah, I wanna just... Maybe discuss it a little bit, you know, if people want to talk about it, I thought we could. I mean, it's the Fallout TV show. I don't think we'll spoil anything because it just came out, but it, most people I've talked to are at least, like, halfway through or working on it, so. I thought it would be a nice chatter point. You guys are always on me about stuff. <sighs> I'm just trying to make things exciting and interesting. Hey, remember when they did a Battle Royale mode in this game and then they got rid of it because it wasn't super popular? I remember. Oh yeah, last stream, didn't we get like a new thing in my bathroom? We got a bathtub now. I'm living in the lap of luxury. Out here in Fault 76. Just kidding, we, I'm not even near Fault 76. Okay, so I gave myself some more ammo. How do I build? I think it's like hold the back button. There we go, because I'm like, what's new? I can build an ally. Only one ally can be placed at a time. I can only have one guy, and I have the guy that works on the radio? That's depressing. I have nothing else I can make? I just have a radio. Okay, what does the radio guy do? Radio punk. Raider punk radio. So I can only have one dude? I can't have a second guy? 
but I want the free Maximus kind of uh, Brotherhood character in my squad. Well, that's disheartening, to say the least. Yeah, I mean, you should only get in and start watching the Fallout show. You can have a gorilla chair to sit in. That's pretty cool. This is an ammo thing? Alright. What is this? Oh, weapon wall rack. A modern home rug? I forgot. I got a new rug. Where should I put my rug, guys? Think it'll make my bedroom look less depressing? Actually, you know what? For the wasteland. It's not a bad looking room, honestly. I mean, I guess this would look kind of nice. I feel like it needs like a smaller, smaller rug in there. I just want to make it feel more homely, you know what I mean? Like it's it's so wasteland-like, you, you get what I mean? And it's like, it'd be nice to show that I could afford, actually maybe the rug would be best on the third floor. Or maybe where my collectibles are? Nah, the collectibles need a wood area. Well that looks kind of nice in the middle of the floor there. Do I even need a rug? I mean it's a cool thing to have, I have lots of cloth and rubber. Oh, this already has a rug here. I'm thinking this would really nicely divide the room just having a rug in the middle. There we go. Yeah, this this is housing in the modern era. Can't afford a real house, so you get... Uh, you decorate your virtual ones. Is that why housing is so popular in video games? Because of the price of buying a house? Ugh, you know what I mean? Although, anyways, let's let's get going. Yeah, let's do this. I, I grabbed the free Fallout 76 stuff in the backpack and that, but I don't know what I really got in it. I guess we could take a look at that and see what we get here. One, one sec, I'm, I gotta check what this gave me. Because I know it, really my batteries are low. I, I just checked beforehand. Okay, I'll change the batteries. One sec. Do you guys find, like, stuff on the Xbox just, like, doesn't work sometimes? Like, this should have loaded, but it just doesn't work. Play New Vegas in this economy? I did get, uh... Oh, come on, Xbox. Oh, my God. I just want to look at what I got in the stupid backpack. And, uh... Yeah, I guess that's not allowed? I'm not allowed to look at what's in this backpack. I like Fallout 4 a lot. I, I think it's a great game, and we'll be playing it. Yeah, Buyer's Remorse sent me Suicide Squad, so that's that's exciting. Thanks, Buyer's Remorse. I can't imagine who that was. So we'll do a stream of, of I guess, Suicide Squad over this weekend. I just, I want to see what I got in the, the bag, and it's not... Uh... Fuck. It's... You ever just get disappointed with products and you're just like, man, I wish this worked better than it does. That's how I feel about the Xbox a lot of the time. Alright, so apparently no one is joining my squad, which only kind of hurts my feelings, but I, I had it coming. Okay, so perfect storm. There's a machine gun. So it's becoming nighttime. Let's go see if there's any open world activities. If not, we'll just dive into an expedition and see how things go. What is this? Guided meditation. What is guided meditation? There's a couple games that are games. There's a couple quests I need to do to get an achievement. Like, I'm thinking we might do some quests, but I think we need to do some expeditions to start us off with some action. But there's, like... What are these quest things? There's ones for doing certain, like, events. At least I thought there was. Mm. Complete what? Complete ten favors for the White Spring Refuge? Oh god, that sounds like a lot of work. Oh, these are just... Oh, events. The Monster Mash and Breach and Clear. Whatever those are. Monster Mash. Powering up the Monahaga? That sounds lame. I, I've, I think I've seen those before. The Monster Mash? Yeo Gaio Horde? Alright, let's go do an expedition, because there's nothing exciting going on here. Well, we could go do the... what's the dogwood die-off? 
Nah, this stuff's not gonna be cool. Let's go do Atlantic City, but let's do the Flooded City Center Expedition. New Expedition! And if you guys have this, you could jump in and play. Why do Xbox controllers still use AAA batteries? Uh, so that we have the option to switch batteries at any time we want and we don't have to be locked in on a controller where eventually the battery will die and we'll have to throw it out and these controllers will last forever. I hate internal batteries. I, I like that I have the option to swap out double A's. Believe it or not, that's the general consensus for most Xbox users. See, it's great. You go to Costco. You pay 40 bucks, you get these Duracell rechargeable batteries, and they last you like three years. They're great. <laughs> Use the intercom. Take us in. Take us in on this one. I really like Fallout 4. I love the shelter building, the, the adventure, the map's great, you yeah. Is the ghoul in the Fallout games? I mean, there's ghouls in the Fallout games, not like the ghoul Walter Goggin plays. Yeah. Probably the Wi-Fi. My, my Xbox is actually hardwired. Yeah. My, my Xbox is actually hardwired to my, uh... <sighs> to my... Internet. Fight your way through to City Hall, okay. So I've I've never done I like I did the the mission for this the DLC mission and it I was really disappointed cuz I waited a long time for it. So I've been here but I haven't done the expedition for this area so I'm kind of looking forward to it. Bumpers break yeah, the bumpers do break before the batteries go bad. But the the point is is like I like the freedom of of, a, of the AA batteries. It gives me choice. I don't like that it's internal, and I don't like that, you know, my controller can, like, die, and I'll be like, well, we gotta play with it plugged in now and stuff, and... Yeah, I, I prefer the double A's. Oh, jeez. And you know what? I don't have any... I do have stims. Okay, good. Because I was like, I think that campaign mission ruined all of my stims, but uh, apparently I'm good to go. I'm over-encumbered? Ow. I hate... These creatures. See, I love that they take like 50 bullets to kill, but they give you like 10 back. I don't want to drink the water! The water is contaminated, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Why am I over encumbered? Do I not have the weight booster? I'm still over the weight booster? But I, I took care of this. Ah, oh, you gotta be freaking kidding me. Did I pick something up that takes a lot of space or something? A combat knife. I don't need a combat knife. Floater Nasher grenades. More like no thank you grenades. A short flamer. You gotta be kidding me. Well, what is taking up all of my freaking storage space? How do I sort this by damage, value, weight? Okay, what is taking up so much of my freaking space? My ten... A walking cane? What am I gonna do with a walking cane? I'm not house. Okay, so I still have four over for storage. Okay, troubleshooter short, medium range, level 40, 33 damage. Or a troubleshooter's combat shotgun. What shotgun do I have? Oh, no, I already have that one equipped, I guess. No, I don't. I have a combat shotgun. Level 20, 8x8 eight eight damage. What does this do? 9x8 damage. This is technically a better shotgun. Okay, so I guess I should just get rid of this other shotgun then? The combat shotgun? Alrighty, and that gives me enough storage. Cool, we're good to go, guys. Although I feel like I'm going to be using my uh, e-pad here. The hell was that? Where did that come from? And again, if you guys have this game, jump in and give me a help on this one. Fallout First? Uh, they don't have Fallout First right now through Game Pass, but it pops up quite often. I love how I took two steps and I got shot there. Yeah. Can you continue Xbox progress on PC and Steam? Uh, it depends on the game, really. Steam, I don't think it ever really does, does it? Unless your Xbox account is connected through that. Yeah. Hmm. 
I have all the Xbox stuff. I cover Xbox more than most people do. Okay. Let's think about this. This is my favorite bar. Troubleshooters Combat Shotgun. Okay, so that's in there. Alright, let's let's go. I accidentally brought up the shotgun. I, I want the, the perfect storm. I'm hoping that one guy that occasionally watches me stream watches and then comes in and drops me the uh, ammo and stuff because I'm like so out of ammo. Hmm. Wipe out the overgrown? I think the overgrown are gonna wipe me out. Are you not worried about the chaos here, ma'am? This is what happens when you lose all your stim packs doing terrible story busting. I got this. I just, I never understand why this game gets so grindy. Hey look guys, fillet joint. I don't think that's gonna help. I was hoping there'd be like a level 300 that would join. <laughs> Uh, the Fallout First. Yeah, Fallout First, you get a lot of perks, but like, yeah, I'm not paying the monthly to pay or to play this game. It's just, I don't get that kind of benefit out of it. Like, I mean, if this was the only game you played, it might be worth it, but yeah, not, not for me. Damn it. Like, I had some pals, you know, they, they played a lot of the Elder Scrolls online. So, like, it makes sense for them to get that in that situation, but for me, it's like, yeah. Hmm. I thought 76 had cross-progression if you went on the um, Game Pass version of PC. Anyways, it's been a while. Be sure to uh, like the stream. Subscribing's great, donations cool. Consider becoming a channel member. Channel member gifting. They're not even injured. The Patreon option, the Discord for stream alerts, chatter, and aggressively okay times. There's also the Amazon store affiliate link. If you grab anything on Amazon, use the link in the video description. And GamerHeadquarters.com. I write stuff on my site sometimes. How did I miss that axe? That's embarrassing. Yeah, I forgot how grindy this was. I was like, I'll give this another chance. Because I was like, oh, the show is a big deal. And I'm like, we'll do a Fallout thing to stream with the show. And I'm like, Fallout 3, New Vegas, kind of old. I want to save those for other occasions. Fallout 4, we're going to be streaming in like two weeks from now. I was like, we'll do Fallout 76. Because I'm like, it's usually fun. Maybe it's just the story stuff. And it's like, nah, this is grindy. I forgot how grindy this is. Like, why do they need to take so much ammunition? A harpoon? Why is there a harpoon in here? How are we gonna kill these guys? They're crazy. Oh, thanks for coming to channel member there, Flight Demic. Flight Medic Duck. Dunk? Yeah, I'm as I struggle with your name. <laughs> Uh, your Xbox uses gigabit internet. Must be nice. Must be nice. No, we're, we're finally starting to get some better game adaptations, I've noticed, for stuff, which is great for gaming. It just, like, to me, the biggest thing I kind of noticed was, like, man, the Halo show really was a bit of a travesty after <laughs> seeing the Fallout show. I was like, it could be so much better. It's like Microsoft just doesn't care about Halo anymore. That's kind of what it feels like. Or they don't understand Halo or something. I don't know. Did you see there was the report out apparently of what was happening with uh, Halo Infinite? I guess they splintered everyone into teams and they didn't allow any like outside perspectives on the campaign and stuff. And apparently, like right up towards the end of development, they had like a team working on crafting. And this is like I think it was Rebs Gaming was the the source on this, and I guess the guy does like Halo news had this scoop on it. But yeah, apparently they were trying to do crafting for Halo Infinite, which doesn't make any sense at all. How are we even kill these guys? Seriously, like, how do we kill these guys? They're ridiculous. 
Oh, The Last of Us. It was a great show. I mean, it was a perfect adaptation. I actually think the Fallout show was better. I, I liked it more, you know? I also give the Fallout show the edge because they created an original story within the universe and it perfectly worked, whereas The Last of Us was literally just straight adapting. And I mean, the material there is, you know, easy to adapt from it, if that makes sense. But yeah, no, very, very good stuff uh, for gaming right now. I can't wait to see the travesty that is the, uh, the Borderlands movie. Watch them, like, knock the Borderlands movie out of the park and I'll be like, what? I don't think it'll happen, but be interesting. Alright, so I've killed a dozen of these bubble pop things. These guys are a grindy thing. They keep healing. Well, how do we kill them? How do we kill these things? So yeah, that's that's kind of why I give the edge to the Fallout shot. It was just so good. Your parents apparently really enjoying the Fallout show. That's great. That's good to hear. Uh, Nick Offerman, speaking of that guy, he's the... Uh, what is it? He's the president in, in Civil War, if you guys are watching that movie. I still have to do my written review for it, but I did a video review, so we'll see how that goes. I'm trying to do more uh, video review stuff for, like, movies if I can. The only problem is, is they don't do the screenings here anymore, so it's really hard. This is the first screening I did in a long time. I was talking to my movies guy. And I was like, oh, the last time I, I, I saw you was for, like, Top Gun. And I was like, that was last year. And then I'm sitting there and I looked, like, I got home. <laughs> and I was looking at my reviews and stuff. And I was like, oh, Top Gun was two years ago. I was like, woo. <laughs> yeah, time's flying by. I really need to get myself out there to meet someone at this point. I'm, I'm getting way too old. You know, the worst thing is, is I go through my day doing all my work and stuff like that, and then at the end of the day, I, like, I sit on my phone and I'm like, ah, I didn't spend any time on the dating apps today. <laughs> so I'm just like, fuck. <laughs> like, I don't have, know how to describe that, but it's like, I need to do this. And it's like, I got all these other things to do, and I sit there and I'm just like, oh my god. Freaking exhausted. But, uh, lots, lots on the go. Lots, lots of stuff happening. Uh, it's exciting. It's it's entertaining. It's not too serious. I, I didn't watch Arcane. I'm not like huge into the League of Legends stuff, but I've I've heard it's really really good. But uh, yeah, that's that's mostly the thing. Is it's just like the Fallout show. It's it's gory and violent, but not over the top. It all makes sense. It's funny. It's messed up. It's entertaining. It's true to the lore of Fallout and true to like that the humor of that world and the characters are all really likable. I kept waiting for some sort of thing to pop up that I wouldn't like, if that makes sense. Like, I'm like, oh, they're going to do that typical thing that shows nowadays do and, like, ruin it in some weird way or something. And I was like, huh. If any, like, my only thing is, is, like, and I saw some other people complaining about it, too. Uh, the last couple episodes, I do think, teeter a bit. I'm not going to, like, spoil things, but they do, like, the first... Eight episodes are just like absolutely just excellent, and then the last couple are like oh, okay, because it's mostly about setting up like future seasons and whatnot, right? Yeah. Dragon's Dogma too, great game, it was a lot of fun. Humble, this place is a dump. Honest, this is in fact a dump. <laughs> Palms haven't changed much about here. I like you, Mayor Tim. But before we can. <laughs> okay, let's just get this guy hurrying up here. I don't want to listen to his background story. This isn't, like, campaign stuff, so I don't care about these guys, yeah. Yeah, it's just that Fallout works so well. My only kind of, like, kind of thing thinking of Fallout, though, like, the show is, like, I'm, I'm almost a little disappointed it wasn't, like, a closed-off show, like an anthology show, because it would have been really cool if every season of Fallout was, like, a different thing. Like, I'm sure people get attached to the characters and want to see more of them, just like I do. But, like, I am kind of like, I really wish that every season was anthology-like, so that we could see a lot of different parts of, like, the U.S. or of the Fallout world. And I think, like, Fallout works really well for that, being something that, like, you can have a nice set story that can go as long as you want. But you can also, like, do all kinds of different stories, you know? It, you know, it's, it's not like a set thing, it's not specific. You can go anywhere and the universe of Fallout is right for you to do all kinds of storytelling in. 
Hope that makes sense. Speak to Buttercup. Find the Muni Electrician? Alright, let's go find the Electrician. Yeah. Anyways, I, I was really exciting. I gotta go and renew... I guess I'm gonna renew my GICs. Uh, it looks like the house stream is, is even further off now. I, I talked, like, I finally got my status card thing. <laughs> I was, like, looking into the housing stuff, and it's like... Because I'm supposed to be able to get... Like, as part of having... Where is this guy? Is he inside? Oh, God. Is he in there? I had the Muni Electrician. I think he's in there. Or is he around the building? Optional. So which, which which is optional and which is one I actually have to do? Sorry, one sec here. I'm not sure what one I'm supposed to go to. Are they both inside the building or is this one outside the building? I can't tell. Anyways, I was, I was looking into it. All right, well, I called them today to find out information about it. Because they give you, like, money towards your, like, house buy or whatever. And they're like, oh, we're out of funding right now. And I was like, what? And they're like, yeah, we haven't had it since, like, October. And I was like, what? And they're like, yeah, it's just kind of random when it comes in. And I'm like, well, how the fuck is that going to work? So apparently, on the luck of the draw, you can get money towards your house or whatever. And I'm just like, how does that even work for house buying? Uh, but I can't get renovation stuff. But that's also luck of the draw, too. So that's that's exciting. That's an update on my house stuff. What is a GIC? It's uh God damn it, dude. A, a GIC. So like you I mean there's a proper term for what it is, but like basically you you put money in and you lock it for X amount of time and they give you money. It's like a It's not like an interest account, but it's it's basically you're buying a guaranteed uh, like kind of credit thing. They basically they use your money and they like I don't know if gambling is the right word But they they use your money for stuff and then they give you money after a set period of time There's like there's non redeemable which means you can take them out at any time and then there's GICs Which are like They're locked in so you can't access that money, but you get paid out based on it and stuff like that So that's kind of what a GIC is if you're not familiar with the concept. They're very good investment things honestly yeah, you need to pick up Dragon's Dogma. It's a great game. It's really, really good. Yeah. This <laughs> makes it franchise fun as it's not broody all the time, right? The Fallout series is just a lot of fun, but... Yeah, I, I think that kind of explains what a GIC is without, like, just straight up telling you. Like, it's a guaranteed investment certificate, I guess is the fancy nerd, like term, but it's it's like a secure investment, basically is what it is. It is a guaranteed investment. You put this money in, they give you a percentage after, like, as you lock in for certain amounts of time, like, I usually do three months, because uh, I'm wanting to buy a house, right? So I've, I, I'd like to have money available for the time when the time's right. Is he dead? Oh, he just needs to be revived. So there's like one month, three months, six months, nine months, you can do years. And you get like a percentage rate based on how the economy is doing in your country. And then when the period's done, you get money. And you get taxed on it too. Yay! <laughs> and you can put some money in your, it's called TFSA, so it's like there's tax-free. Uh, you can put stuff under, but you can only put so much under the tax-free. And then, yeah, it's, it's a whole thing. And then there's RSPs. It's, it's all about investment stuff. If you have money, you should really get yourself a, a bank. Uh, person? I don't know what I call them, but bank advisor? You should, yeah, if you if you have a decent amount of money sitting there, get yourself a bank advisor and, uh, you know, you, you can make money off of your money, because otherwise your money is just sitting there not doing anything for you, but you can use the GICs and stuff to make money with your money, if you don't need it access to you. So, does that, does that kind of explain it? You're at a bar? Good for you, Supa. I mean, it'd be weird if you weren't at a bar. Where is Filet at? He joined my squad, and he's, he's not even in Atlantic City. Oh my god. Or did that make the enemies easier because Filet left? Maybe this is a good thing. Anyways. Uh... Yeah, but I would recommend getting a bank advising stuff, because... You know, there's, there's a lot of money you can make by having your money that's just sitting there. Uh, make money for you. And depending on how much you have, you can actually make some pretty good cash. 
Yeah, so it's, it's just kind of sad because I wanted to, like, seriously get, like, a place or something, but... I don't know. I, I'm gonna have to talk to my advisor, which I gotta set up for on Monday, because all my GICs come out at the same time. I'm gonna have to see what kind of mortgage I could potentially get, but I'm probably gonna just lock my money away again. I don't know if that's exciting for you guys, but yeah. You're in my house? What are you doing in my house? You need to get out here and get into the action flay. I think. Or I don't know if that makes it easier that you're not here. I, I don't know how this works. So anyways, if you guys have questions about banking stuff and GICs, I can help you. But yeah, to think, I've, I've had like years where I've just had like a good amount of money just sitting there. And it was just like worthless in a checking account. Oh, come on! Why is this game so obnoxiously brutal and emotionally turmoiling? So tonight was supposed to be an easy stream for me. Never it is. <laughs> Nothing goes my way. But, <laughs> yeah, because we've been doing, like, some pretty hardcore, like, campaign streams. I don't, I don't know if you guys missed it, but we did, uh, we did Ghost Recon Future Soldier yesterday, which was, like, seven hours. It was fun, though. I, I liked it. Got a little hardcore, but it was enjoyable. Ah, oh, me, dude. Oh, thanks for the donation there, homeless bird. Hot dogs and other sources of sustenance. Gotta get some of those uh, Starbucks drinks. I drink the Starbucks drinks because it reminds me of the sweet taste of luxury. Yeah. I don't know. Like I said, though, if I had just been smarter and found somebody and, like, married younger, I'd actually be pretty coasting right now. Seriously. Pretty coasting. Are you the guy that keeps nuking me? Like, what? The, how am I supposed to, like, f this is stupid. This is why I was, like, last time so mad at this game and didn't want to play it anymore. This is just stupid. Like, they just keep respawning and eating me. Nathan's beef hot dogs? I disagree. It's all about the Costco hot dogs. You can't beat a dollar fifty-eight. Yeah. It's just nice, because I can be reminded of the simpler, more affordable time when I go out and I go to Costco and I get my tasters and my affordable hot dog. An explosives crate? I don't think it's gonna help me. Okay, so somehow I need to kill... How did you get up here? I'm gonna be out of ammo before I actually get this done. Oh, come on! They, they all come up here? <laughs> this is terrible. I hate this. I don't have any stim packs because last time I streamed this, this stupid game wasted all of my fucking health because the New Jersey Devil boss was like the most ridiculous overpowered thing in the world. <sighs> Dragon's Dogma 2 or Baldur's Gate? Um, I, I, I guess it depends on which type of game you want. Do you want an adventuring game? Well, they're both adventuring games. It's like, do you want more, like, story, or do you want more of, like, role-playing kind of epic adventure stuff, right? Uh, anyway, it's lots of fun. Always a great day. Look, they're literally spawn-killing me. Can I, like, stealth over there? Can I just be like, you can't see me. I'm detected. They know I'm here. Caution. Oh, fuck right off, man. See, this is why people don't play their game as much, developers. Oh. See, what happened is they had the development off to, like, this third-party studio, and the game's just gotten, like, worse. It was fun before this update. Fun. You went drinking with your ex-gal? I feel like I couldn't emotionally do that with like an ex or something. But then again, everyone that I interact with that like kind of like something bad happens between us, they always end up just like hating me for some reason. Even if I don't do anything wrong and they're the ones that like split off from me, it's like I always end up being like the... <laughs> you know, there's, there's always me that gets treated badly and I, I never understand why. I really don't get that, so yeah, I, I can never imagine doing that. 
Like, come on, this is not fun gameplay. Why would you design this like this? Seriously, who has fun playing the game where you just get, like, massacred? It's like I'm playing Dark Souls, but it's Fallout. Okay, I revived this idiot. Okay, please don't. He's gonna get insta-killed by all of the things again. Yeah, he's the Death Claws. Let's, like, look at this. Look, look, look at all these enemies. Ugh. Yeah. I, I think this, the world of Fallout 76 is really, really good. The The story is horrendous, and the beginning part of this game is really bad. Like, if you go play the other story stuff, and not this, like, the Atlantic City DLC was, like, one of the most disappointing things I've ever seen in a game. Like, I was hyped for months to play it, and it, it, it sucked. But, like, if you go play the other stuff, like, there's Wastelanders, which is, like, about, uh, like, a Fort Knox thing. If you play the Brotherhood and the other expansion to this game, those are so good. Great stories, lots of fun. The base game story sucks, and this game story is horrendous. So, uh, yeah. Like, this, this DLC, this Atlantic City stuff, is just absolute trash. They dropped the ball so hard on it. Yeah. Melt those AI. They're just gonna insta-kill me. I need to build. Why do I need to build? It's Fallout. Ugh. <sighs> It just kills me, man. See, I was killing all these guys, and they just, like, respawn, and then more of them appear, and then I just keep getting insta-killed. And they waste all my health packs on that stupid... Like, look how many enemies there are. This is designed for, like, four people. Oh, he's got a rocket launcher, and he sees me. I guess I should just give up on doing this, because I'm not going to be able to do this. There's too many enemies. I'm gonna, like, run out of bullets before I kill them, honestly. Like, this is ridiculous. Overgrown thorn in my side, am I right? But believe it or not, like, if you're not playing this part of the game, the game's really good. Yeah. But I have to say, this expansion to this game, Atlantic City, is like one of the most disappointing things I've ever experienced in gaming. I was so excited. I was literally logging in, like, every day to grab my free item just so I could prepare for my stream of it, and then the story just sucked. Yeah. How do you start the Brotherhood questline? Whew. That's a good question. That's a very, very good question. Are you, um... <laughs> well, you... I honestly don't really know at this point. Okay, so in, in this game... In this game, there are a bunch of different stuff. Like, I don't know if you have to do the Wastelanders to get to the Brotherhood, or if you can just do the Brotherhood thing. Because the Brotherhood thing is attached to the Raiders. Because, like, the Raiders and the Brotherhoods are, like, two different factions in this game. And there's, like, one of the packs is, like, Reign of Steel, I think, and the other pack's another thing. But those, it's like a two-parter. Like, I, don't, I can't remember if it's the Brotherhood is the first part, and the Raiders is the second part, or if the Raiders is the first part, and the Brotherhood is the second part. But, like, it's one big story told over two sections. And the Wastelanders precedes that. So if, if that makes, like, I'm hoping that kind of makes sense to you, because, they, they, like, you got to remember these updates, they came, like, over years of time, right? Like, years and years and years of time. Oh, crap, I didn't think you could get up here. So that's, uh, that's basically what happened, but it, it's just, I think you got to do some of the starter stuff, and then eventually you can do the, the Brotherhood thing. God damn this electrician. I was really hoping we'd have random people join in and carry me through this. I have dreams. Axis or axis for a reason. I don't know if I agree with that. I see a lot of people that have really healthy relationships and stuff with people that they've dated. And like it really depends on your emotional context and understanding to each other, I guess, and also how things went. 
like I said, there's situations where, like, I think I could have better, or at least peaceful, I guess, relations with people that I've been with. But, like, none of them are ever, like, people that, like, talk or communicate. They just kind of, like, shut her off and act all weird. But it really depends on the type of person, honestly. Yeah. It really depends on the type of person. Fallout Shelter. Fallout Shelter's so good. I heard it got an update, and I was thinking of checking it out for that. He gave his membership to the Joker? Yeah, guys. Filet gifted Suicide Squad, so you guys can watch that crap over the next couple of days. Yeah. Super. Remember when Supa could have unlocked us a new emote, but his wife had an iPhone? Allegedly. And allegedly I was sitting here waiting for you to like the stream. Subscribing's great donations. Cool. Consider becoming a channel member. Channel member gifting. The Patreon option. The Discord for stream alerts, chatter, and okay times. There's also the Amazon store play link, if you're into that kind of thing. Is it the water that extinguishes them and makes them so they can't be killed? Because this is just ridiculous. Like, I shouldn't be doing this. Like, I, this game needs some better balancing on this crap. Go, electrician. Do the next task. Do the next task, electrician. I'll distract them. I guess. It's like I'm freaking fighting the creature from the, the Black Lagoon here on steroids, and there's like nine of them. I feel like my bullets are, like, mildly inconveniencing this stuff. Did you finish the thingy? Oh, that's just a challenge. Oh, there's a new lesser devil. Great. I don't know. Enter the community center. Okay. Where does the community center at? Is it over there, or is it the town center? Optional, speak to Buttercup. I don't want to speak to Buttercup. I don't like Buttercup. I think I gotta go over here to the community center. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. A menu, is it? Uh, for quests in this game? You, you kind of... It's, it's the same as any Fallout if you've played them. You just kind of, like, interact with people, and it, it sort of it guides you along, if that makes sense. Yeah. It, it guides you along and, and whatnot. Like, I'm sure you could probably Google, like, a specific video for how to start the Brotherhood quest and it would tell you requirements. But like I said, it was it was years ago, right? Like, this was... Like, like even when I, I did it later, too, like, Kevin and I, we did it while we were streaming. Like, we did a stream of it. Uh, we were role-playing and everything. But it was, like, that was during COVID that we did it. But even that was, like, I think a year after it came out and stuff. You would rather go to Canada and buy me a drink instead of allowing us to have a new abode on the channel? <gasps> Can you play as Todd Howard in Fallout 76? I'm sure you could make a Todd Howard character if you were into that kind of thing. Activate the defense systems. Okay. What's my situation like for my items? How much, how much ammo do I have? Am I guy drunk? Oh my god. I think my character's thirsty. I've got a harpoon. That's not gonna do anything for me. I have unopened packs. Six unopened packs? <gasps> Woo! Dad is washing the Corvago with his son. No, I, I didn't get to read that. I didn't get to read that. Pick a perk. Action points regenerate 15% faster. That actually sounds pretty cool. Hmm, bodyguards. Gain six resistance for each friend born a survivor. See, the problem is a lot of these cards, too, they're kind of based around the idea that you have friends to play with. A dry nurse. So I've got four luck, 15 endurance. How do I upgrade my... I always want to rank up this stuff. So survival, start some strength. Blah, blah, blah. I need to upgrade my luck in that. Okay, what are we doing? You guys are level 200. Holy. So I need to activate the defense thing. You know what else was super disappointing in this game? Is this level, or this area, like Fallout 76 Atlantic City, has this beautiful aquarium. And it's not even in the story content. I was like, are you kidding me? I'm over encumbered. God damn it. Oh, come on! 
I need more time. A food pill? Yeah. Uh, I need some damage perks. Well, I just occasionally play this game and try to have fun with it. I, I'm not here to have like a specific like build and everything. I don't know, maybe the developers don't get that, but sometimes you just want to hop on a Fallout game and have some fun without having to do like intensive story builds and sort of game builds. Basically, I need a story mode. Alright, so let's go and let's get this show on the road. I mean, we've got defensive turrets up here. They're not doing anything. This is a nice looking community center that's got a big tree growing through the middle of it for some reason. Or are they not working because I have to turn on the grid or something? It says I'm in the vicinity of it. Is it up above? No, it's not in this room, I don't think. Did I go the wrong... Oh, for fuck's sake. So this is what I'm talking about. I shouldn't die this fast. Oh, yeah. It's just ridiculous. Hey, look, there's more people joining. Texadecta. See, you all get bonuses. The more people you have together, the more you achieve. Okay, right, so it says that I'm supposed to be here for this challenge, but I doth not see what I'm supposed to be interacting with. It says I'm, like, right in the area for it. Maybe it's up above? Well, it takes you up there. Yeah, it says, unless it's, like, through this wall or something. That guy's got a rocket launcher. Also, another thing. Why... Why do all the plants have rocket launchers? To power... The power to deliver justice is in your hands. I'm sure it is. There's a bowler, that's exciting. A silver plate. Okay, apparently... There's a defense system to activate. But I don't know where it is. Is this it? The turret control. Oh god. I don't like doing this. Likeness zero, okay. Oh. Alright, I did it. Good for me. Oh, a stim pack. And see, the thing is, I had so many stim packs until I did that stupid story mode. And it used up all my stim packs fighting, like, the Jersey Devil. It was heartbreaking. Absolutely heartbreaking. On Steam Deck? Steam Deck would be fun for that one. See, there's a part of me where I'm kind of like, I missed out on not getting the Steam Deck, but I'm also kind of like, eh, this is what it is. Lasagna Kid? That's funny. Where's Lasagna Kid from? I remember the name, but I can't remember what the reference was. Lasagna Kid. Is that person in a match of ours on something? My gun is broken. Well, fuck me, man. killed one of them. Oh, I forgot, I have stims. Nope, I'm out of stims. I thought I just picked up stims. Never mind, I didn't get any stims. Yeah, I mean, if they would have sent me the Steam Deck faster, I would have owned one. It's just from the point of re-pre-ordering, it took a year for them to offer it to me, and I was just like, nah, I missed out on everything. Yeah, I can't remember, how do we fix guns? I think we go to the gun, we click, no, that's not it. Oh, it's the right stick, there we go, repair. Hey look, Filet's got himself a saw. I thought the repair terminal was right over here, is this not where the repair terminal is? Kinda hard to use if I'm getting shot by things. Okay, that's the wrong gun. I need to use my machine gun. Oh my god. A community center. It's more like a hell center is what this is. Does he just keep healing himself? Like, how am I supposed to kill something like this? So wait, did that one guy join and just leave? That other guy joined. Is he killing anything? He's just kind of sitting over there. Yeah. 
Hmm. Rise of the Ronin. I was actually surprised that 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 one, Dragon's Dogma 2 and Rise of the Ronin, I was very surprised were not more popular streams. Like, I was actually expecting, like, double the numbers for viewership on those two. I was like, wow, okay. I mean, I don't really care, but I was just kind of like, huh, this is a bit of a shocker, you know what I mean? You kind of, you expect certain, like, performances from things, and you just go, huh, that's a bit weird. Yeah. Alright, alright, let's hack this stupid thing. Complete luck if I get this. Oh! Good for me. Man, I wish I was that lucky in love. Could you imagine just coming across the perfect person that they like you two at the same time? You're just like, wow, this is amazing. And they don't like ghost you or burn you in like a week or two? It'd be amazing. Yeah. You're weed whacker. What do you think you're gonna be weed? Oh, I get it. You got a weed whacker because we're killing plants? Okay, that's actually pretty funny. Yeah, that's that's actually hilarious. All right, so where is this last thing we need? It's over this way. Okay, so allegedly, it's right here somewhere, but I don't see it. Is it in the wall? Is it in the basement? No. Is it above? It's not in the ticket stand area. Mentats. I'll take some Mentats. I'll use some Rad X. Potato crisps. I'll eat those. A lost dossier? I'll take that as well. So yeah, apparently there's a third defense thing. Somewhere here. Oh, it must be over here. Okay, I found it. Oh, what the hell is eating me right now? A rad roach? Oh. That's a bit of a shocker. Any days lately? That's what I was talking about earlier. Is like, I literally, like, I do so much work, and then when I go to bed, I lie there, I'm like, man, I really wish I would have spent like a second on the dating apps. I have had no time. Ugh, I try to take some downtime when I can too, but it's just like, I've actually been so busy. And I also seem to lack interest in it. I know it's something I need to do and want to do, and would be better for it, but I just completely lack interest in it. I think other people have just burned me out. <laughs> okay, I think I need this fan. I, I can't pick it up, damn it, because, like, the copper and stuff. Is there any way to raise my, like, inventory hold in this game other than, like, artificial boosters? Because, like, man, I could use some extra, like, storage for crap. Yeah. I hope your household has a good weekend. Fultz on PC. This be nice. The Fallout 4 update? It's on 25th. We'll stream it and do a video of it, too. You have my backpack in Vigor? It's the best thing. My ba my face on a bag in, in Vigor is, is vigorously exciting. Oh, who is this character? Showman Toaster. Oh, that's- is that a real- that's a real person? There's a real person here that's not on our team? Well, that doesn't make any sense. Or is this- are you- are you a person? Oh yeah, or are you an AI? I can't tell if you're a person or an AI. There's something pretty messed up about that. Anyways, we're fighting through the flooded city. No, they killed her! She had such style and flair. You don't find that in the wasteland anymore. Yeah. They ask if you own a car. I mean, like, honestly, if I was dating on a, or on a dating app and someone didn't have a car, I would probably not at all be interested. But I'm also a lot older, too. I guess it depends on where you live as well, depending on, like, the needs of where you live, but, like, yeah. Like I said, the quality, too, on the dating apps is so depressing. It's like, a lot of them are like, Oh, I'm a single mother. Oh, I'm unemployed. And it's just like, I'm so old. I need someone that has somewhat of their life together, please. Just a basic job. 
I don't even ask for much. <laughs> just, uh. Yeah, ideally I could come across someone that has a similar amount of savings as I do and they want to buy a house. That would be ideal, but that's not going to happen. Like a needle in a haystack. Inside the haystack and within that needle. Yeah. Fallout London. Yeah, I don't, I don't know if we're gonna do Fallout London. I I was uh, told that I need the uh, the DLC and everything, and I guess the Steam version of Fallout London. I I, I gotta decide. I got to like the 19th for their so like a sale on Steam, so I'll decide if I want to buy it. It's just like yeah, you know, I wish the streams brought in such good money that I could fruitlessly buy all the silly stuff. But you know, I gotta be smart about things. So yeah, maybe I'll talk to my Bethesda contact. But I have my Bethesda contact working on more important things for me right now, so I'm not gonna bother them with that. Yeah. I mean, like, again, like, a car, I think, is, like, a pretty important thing to have. Like, I would be legitimately shocked. A spore master? If someone I was dating, especially where I live, didn't have a car, you'd be like, oh god. Because then they're just using you to get around. You know what I mean? Like, I, I feel like people would just be, if they don't have a car, they just, they want to ride is what I would be thinking, right? I don't know if I'm crazy in that regard, but... Yeah. The Creative Decision 30 FPS. I was, I was coming up with a funny, like, joke thing where Xbox, they should hire, like, uh, they should, Xbox should be like, Xbox, the only platform where you get cinema, all games, 30 FPS or less. <laughs> Yeah. Hmm. You know what? I mean, I I don't know. I, I I don't think it's too much of an expectation to have some, have someone like want a car, unless you lived in like a place where cars weren't like a big deal. You know, some cities are designed around other ways of transportation, but like seriously, I would. I wouldn't even take two seconds on someone that didn't have a vehicle where I live. And yeah, it's, it's just like a base requirement for me. Uber? I, I guess? I don't know. The Gas Station Simulator? I never played Gas Station Simulator. I have a House Flipper video coming tomorrow because I've had several requests for House Flipping Simulator 2. I don't know why, but I've had several. <laughs> so that's coming tomorrow. And uh, this game called Broken Roads, which is uh, Australian Fallout. If, if you guys like, you know, classic Fallout games and stuff, like, it's basically Australia. It's kind of like Elys or uh, Disco Elysium, but it's like you're in Australia in the nukes drop. It's kind of a cool game. I had some good laughs with it, so that'll be a video tomorrow, too. But yeah, House Flipper and that one are on the queue. I got a bad feeling about this. See, look, I've almost burned through, like, 3,000 bullets that that one guy gave me. I'm just going to be completely out of ammo again. These guys are such bullet sponges. It's like I'm playing The Division, but The Division gives you ammo. And this game starves you. Anyways, we have to kill the Spore Master. Women who ask for cars just want finances. Well, like, again, I, I'm not, like, again, I'm not trying to, like, you know, say I know what your situation is. I'm just trying to put from my perspective, like, like, people, when you're dating, they're always trying to, like, first off, dating is a game nowadays of, of aesthetics and whether or not someone likes how you look. And then from there on, because, you know, they're swiping on the apps, and from there on, it's how you interact when they talk to you in text. And from that point forward, when they do meet you and stuff, it's about getting a size of you. Are you someone that, like, you know, is what I want in terms of, like, financials? Are you someone I want in terms of, like, what you have to offer for perks and stuff? And one of the ways that I would size up someone's value would be 
uh, you know, sort of their financial offerings, especially as I'm in my, like, late 20s here. I'd be kind of like, do you have, like, debt? Do you have a car? Do you have a house? It, it, it tells you a little bit about, like, are you working towards these things? And it tells you a bit about their goals and their aspirations and allows you to kind of, like, size up and value where they're at in life. And, uh, it's, yeah, it's, it's kind of a pretty basic thing. Again, where I live, like, I couldn't imagine dating someone that didn't have a vehicle. It would just be, like, a complete hindrance in doing anything where I live. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But you could explain around why you don't have a car and stuff. You heard decent things about house flippers. I, I flip cars, man. Yeah, I'm, I'm a car, I'm a house flipper. I do it all. And I also get you guys to like the stream. Subscribing's great, donations cool, consider becoming channel member. Channel member gifted, the Patreon option, the Discord for stream alerts, chatter, great times. There's an Amazon store affiliate link if you're into that kind of thing, and yeah, that's everything. Alright, let's speak to Lenox and let's get the hell out of this place. Oh, man. That wasn't a very fun expedition. Stay single and invest in video games? Well, again, I'm at that point in life where I really, really need to meet somebody that's got their life together. I talk about it all the time. But it's like, yeah, it's, it just kind of sucks that everyone I seem to interact with dating-wise, they just... They're all... they have so many problems and stuff. It's exhausting. I feel like other people's problems wear on to me because it's like, you know, a lot of the time I feel like it's not my fault things don't go well. I certainly put my effort forward. Yeah. Yeah. And I'm in, I, again, I, 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 like I said, man, I don't know your situation and I'm not here to like fix things and stuff for you, but I'm just saying why, you know, how, or a car is like a metric. Especially in your, like, 20s for me, that would be, like, a big thing. Yeah. Take me home. It's been a hell of a day, Lenox. You You're damn right. Get us the hell out of here. Hop in and I'll fire her up. Sounds good, Lenox. Sounds good. Do -do -do -do. Complete the human condition. That was an achievement? Oh. Well, what are we missing, then? Kill ten lesser devils with a melee weapon? I should try to get that achievement. Become allies with Crater? I'm surprised I don't have that. Complete Sophia's story. How do you do this crap? So you got all these, like, quests I don't know how to do. Monster Mash, Breach and Clear are, like, missions. Yeah. Brain Freeze. Shouldn't have drank all that cold stuff, man. People don't give you a chance. Some people are just like that, man. The Rover? Australian post-apocalyptic movie? I don't think I've actually seen The Rover. No problem, Flay. Always happy to help you with the XP. And you know what? There's also nothing you can do to get people to specifically talk to you or give you a chance on things. You just have to, you know, accept a lot of things, right? But anyways, we should probably move on from this discussional point. I'm glad we did that, guys. We did a good job of that. Just kind of teleported through my floor. Oh yeah, I need to craft, uh... I need to craft ammo. I should probably put more of my stuff to be sold. Yeah, I've only got like 30 spots left. Wait, mini nuke. Damaged hazmat suit. That might actually be helpful. The Blackwater Brew weighs that much? Are you for real? I feel like it's... Oh, it's just not the total inventory. Okay. I feel like the weighting is wrong on this. Armor. Inventory. How much space does the mini nuke take up? Four spots. 
Got like a lot of food stuff. Cause I'm just like, I should probably put some of this stuff to sale in my, uh, got all these fusion cores. I don't need fusion cores. Makes me over encumbered. We're gonna have to pick another expedition in a sec here, cause I'm sure this guy will want to get waiting, but I'm just trying to like, Open up my inventory a bit, if that makes sense. At least I try my best to. There's just so much, like, crap all the time, right? Fusion core. I'll sell under 27. Gamma rounds. Harpoons? Uh, two bucks a harpoon. Okay, well, what is taking so much space on my freaking inventory? Show a sort by weight. The short flamer, which has actually been very helpful for burning people alive. Assassin's Raider power armor. Ten weight? Oh my god. How much does this let's just get rid of this and my thing there. That opens up my inventory a little bit. Like I don't even have many guns or anything. And yet I'm always out of like space. A cultist dagger? What what, what do you do with a cultist dagger? Nuka Cola Twist? Nuka Cola with it. Nuka Shine. Ooh. A weightless leather piece? No, oh, it really is weightless. Okay, so does that help my inventory a bit? Yeah, it gives me like 20 spots. Alright, let's go do another expedition. Actually, let's go see. Are there any like world events going on? Load bearing. I uh, sent you the location for the cryptid monitor. Yeah, that's nice to know. Thanks for the location of the whatever monitor. Alright, let's go do another expedition. Yeah, okay. Should we do... Well, the pit's kind of lame. Atlantic City. Should we go do Tax Evasion or the Boardwalk? Uh, the most sensational game. Done it quite a few times, but let's, let's do this expedition. Failed to start the expedition? <gasps> Horde mode <laughs> activates when you get the house. What? Ah. Uh, well, if you think bad things in a car, you shouldn't talk about it. It's good to have fun with it, and I get the serious stuff. What's good to have fun with? I don't know. I live life. I have a good day to day, but like honestly, it's just like obviously I desire like fun companionship and stuff too. Not something bad to strive towards. Okay, I need to go to the bathroom though. Freaking tired. Uh, here's a video clip of me with my alpaca friend Gizmo. I'll I'll be back in a sec. I'm back, guys. <gasps> I'm back. Nuka Shine will make me strong. Yeah, isn't the alpaca the best? Drink Nuka Shine. Am I the only one that didn't, like, read the telecom? I'm so sorry. Okay, let's do this. I don't even know why I'm tired. I was exhausted recently. I 
I hope the rest of my team helps me. In Atlantic City. Okay, apparently I'm the only one that came to Atlantic City. Let's level up. I got to level up three times? Oh, wow. Pick a perk. Okay, um, Charisma? And Aqua Boy, max rank. Armorer. And ammo is- I forgot to craft fucking ammo. Oh my god, I'm an idiot. Yeah, I forgot to... I forgot to craft ammo. I'm screwed. Oh no. <laughs> oh no! So I still have 11 points? I thought I had more space. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. I thought I unlocked more charisma space, no? Ah, oh, goddammit. Okay, at least Matt Art is here to help me. I don't know who that is, though. It's two times XP for Fallout 76? Great, this is my chance to level up like a boss. How many bullets do I got? A thousand. No, yeah, that's not gonna work. Okay. Are you the play area guy? Yeah, whatever, dude. I've done this like 9,000 times. Let's do it! Blah, 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 blah. Let's go kick some ass and chew some bubblegum. I don't know where I was going with that one. <sighs> Anyways, you guys have any other riveting conversation you want to go over tonight? I'm all ears for discussional points, honestly. It's, uh, it's exciting when we have chatter to go over and, and whatnot. <sighs> hmm... I hate these stupid things. Okay, what is the achievement for these overgrown? Oh god, I'm getting blasted. Oh, fuck me, man. <laughs> I hate these overgrown monsters. Kill a hundred with fire. Ah, oh, we should bring out the flamethrower. Well, dude, you just gotta focus on yourself and, you know, all that other stuff. I don't know. There's, there's programs that can help you if you have problems in life. I mean, the best I can do is stream and chat about stuff, but like, you know... I, I, I can't carry it forward and fix things for you. I can burn these weeds though. Oh my god. Did it at least die from my fire so I get that achievement? That would be nice. In Vault 76. But how about that Fallout show? You guys liking that? Hmm. Well, that was a drop in views. Alrighty, let's focus up and kill some things. Now look, a buoy. I always wonder if I can... Oh, we can steal the life preserver? Can I put it in my house? Because that would be cool. Overgrown Moonflower. Are you dying? A mode after taking out other competitors. Oh yeah, I forgot we're supposed to go kill the competitors, aren't we? I'm gonna get shot by these guys. Oh, okay, fuck me, man. Oh, There you go, Flay. Do we have a self-help mode thing? Alright, so I need to kill these guys. But I also need to burn alive overgrown things for an achievement. Hi, competitors! Wow, they really dropped me out. The Fallout first stuff? Well, you know, they're just trying to make sure that they got a good steady base that they can keep milking for money and stuff like that. Can you really blame them for wanting to get better cash flow going? Especially if people will pay for that kind of thing. I mean, it makes sense. It's like an ongoing multiplayer game. But I, I can see how that would turn some people off. Yeah, like, personally, I don't. Like, I've tried the Fallout first thing through the Game Pass perks and stuff, but, like, I've never really... 
gotten like the value of it if that makes sense but you get like items and stuff right so that's kind of cool if you're into the you know you want like in-game items and stuff it's kind of a thing yeah remember we're supposed to after we kill people we're supposed to like do showboating so yeah competitors live up to their name <laughs> 30 FPS. No, this this is FPS boost or not FPS boost. Sorry, it's it's next gen aware is is what it is. So yeah, it actually runs at up to 60 FPS. Wait, you're the fire guy. I'm supposed to burn you alive. Oh god, it's too late. They're all dead. He killed them. Good job, guys. Good job. Ah, right, we need to kill more uh, competitors, I guess. Right. We get more bonus points if we win this game faster. Okay, so we have to go back now? Eliminate the final overgrown. Oh, we have to eliminate the moonflowers. Okay. Let's go find this last moonflower thing. He's giving me a thumbs up. Nice. Sucks to suck. Okay, where's this creature at? How do we miss this creature? Is there like an easier en there is an easier entrance way, okay. Let's go team. Hmm. Hello there, mannequin. That's where I got the swimsuit, guys. That's where I got the swimsuit, okay. So we have to burn an overgrown flower. Let's do it. At least I think it's over here. Am I going the wrong way? Is this not where this thing is? It says it's over here. I might literally be going the wrong way. Yeah, I know it's up here. Bird, baby, bird. Let's go with bird. Oh. Burn that mother down. This is why I keep the flamer, guys. It's heavy, but it can burn things when I need it to. Which is great. Progression is slow if you don't follow first. I haven't really noticed my progression changing, but yeah. You're not watching my stream at 60 FPS? What are you, watching an Xbox first party <laughs> Series X game? Haha! <laughs> yeah, you get like perks and benefits and stuff like that, for sure. With Fallout first, and it does help you, but like, I don't, I don't know if it really changes the game in a way, if that makes sense. Yeah. I I have the NCR armor. I got that from a Fallout First perk, I believe. If I'm not crazy, but it's it's been a while. You get lots of random stuff in these games over the years. Hmm. I think the thumbnail hits pretty good though today. It was kinda nice. Oh, high energy. High energy guys. Hi there folks. Hmm. Alright, let's get this done. We've got some competitors to beat. We've got Glory to win. We gotta beat Juchi. Juchi? Juchi? It's time for our warm up. Let's see what you're bringing to the table today. I'm bringing bug snacks and emotional sorrows, and uh, apparently uh, the sorrows of the chat. This is for you guys! But, uh, yeah. Hmm. I'm here for you, Juki Basturi. Although I'm more into his sister, to be honest. Oh god. There's too many of them, what are we going to do? He's walking at me with the flamethrower and taking minimal amounts of damage. You've got to be kidding me. guys are spongier than the division. Don't forget to emote after you kill them. It's unsportsmanlike, but it's it's the way things go around here. Ah, this guy's just killing everyone. Why don't I kill people like these people kill people? This 
guy is a sponge. Look at him, our teammate just burned him and he's just taking it. Oh, that's my teammate. I thought my teammate was beside me until I realized it's the bad guy. You'd get into this if you didn't have lots of other games to play. That's totally fair, honestly. There's so many games out there these days to play. Like, some people, when they release their game, they get disappointed that it doesn't, like, totally catch on, but I'm like, there's so much competition, you have to have be so lucky or put lots of money into it. Uh, the Fallout 76... Uh, I think it was called Nuclear War. That game mode is gone. They removed that, like, I think five years ago, I believe. Fallout first is Bliss for Resources and stuff. Huh. You're talking about, like, in playing your own servers? He's coming back, and he's going to be more powerful than you could ever imagine. I heard he's also bringing Sexy back, which is even scarier. I didn't know we lost Sexy, but apparently it shall return. Alright, let's enter the aquarium. And this is what I was talking about. Is I was so disheartened that they built this beautiful aquarium. And they didn't even use it as part of the story mode. Blood travesty. Love that a lot of these games play laser duck shooting. I'm trying to like unlock. You have to do like task favors for these guys. Have a nuke, and then as you do task favors for these guys, you get to um, you get to like get tokens, and then you can build the stuff in your house. And escape from Tarkov mode. I don't think they would add that to this. That would have to be its own Fallout game. Yeah. Tarkov is a cruel mistress. I wouldn't know. I'm only into Vigor because my face is on a bag in that game. I mean, how many times do you get your face on a bag in a video game? It's not a common situation. It's not common at all. Hell, some would say it's not common enough. I don't have any stims left. Oh, God. Rataway, away? Really? What do you even do with pre-war money in this typewriter? Actually, I need that for the copper. A burnt textbook? Sure, I'll take it. Oh, this is where we're gonna have to defend some areas. But this is what I was saying, is like, this game has like, the coolest aquarium. Not even part of the story mode. I was like, what?! We gotta protect ghouls? I don't know. Somehow, sexy returned. My perks are for not losing hunger? Okay, that's strange. Not using the casino in story mode? Well, for Grand Theft Auto V, the... the Was it the blue diamond? The black diamond? Whatever the casino is, the that wasn't there at launch. The, uh, the casino was a post-launch update for Grand Theft Auto. Wish it was in Fallout 4, right? It is, it's, it's like a bit of a waste. Like, they have this really cool environment, and they don't use it. Because if you guys go back, and you watch my, like, streams ahead of Atlantic City, where we were kind of getting excited, we were playing these expeditions. <laughs> like, you could see me sitting there being like, oh, I can't wait to see this in the story mode, it's gonna be so cool. And then, like, they just, they never used it. I was like, are you freaking kidding me? I was like, what? I died? Oh, okay. Just got shot in the face, I guess. Oh, I forgot. Be sure to like the stream. Subscribing's great. Donations cool. Consider becoming a channel member. Channel member gifted. The Patreon option. The Discord for stream alerts, chatter, and incredibly cool to okay to average to below average and sometimes all right times. There's also an Amazon store for lately, if you're into that kind of thing. Easy ways to support the content on the channel. Hmm. 
Wait, are we all sharing the ammo we get off of the bodies? Because that's crazy. Where are the sea turtles? Oh, where are we going? I think we we're supposed to be escorting this woman, and she's kind of like ran off. Uh, where where is she? Can't believe how much health they have, or how much ammo they take. Bullet sponges, all of them. Whoa, what's going on? We got some rockets? Didn't realize I was fighting the Overgrown. Oh my god, he's got a flamethrower too. Ugh, I gotta get out of here. I want no part of that. Like, look at this. You'd be able to come in and listen about fish and stuff. Uh, cool aquarium. That's something I was always disappointed about. I was in... I can't remember what it's called. I think I was in, like, Burnaby or something like that. Somewhere around Vancouver when I was doing hockey. Uh, when I was a lot younger. And they had an aquarium. And everyone in my family got to see the aquarium, but I didn't because I was playing hockey. And I was like, son of a... It was kind of like, I think they call it a sucks to suck scenario is what that was. Find the bubblegum bear? Oh, we forgot to grab bubblegum bear! Ah, oh, I know where he is too, we missed him. We missed bubblegum bear. But I love the idea of these like overgrown aquariums where it's kind of like the aquariums are still thriving and all the people are gone or dead. Kind of cool. Ugh, oh, I should probably have some rad away, eh? Get rid of that rad stuff. The casino building, was there a launch? I don't think so. It was like a later thing, wasn't it? Filet's game crashed? That's not real. I love when we do, uh, was it Grand Theft Auto streams? And it's like, they're really decently popular, depending on when we do them. And like, I just, like, I'm so disinterested in playing that game. And I just sit there for like, probably at least an hour and a half of the streams we do, and I just sit there and I like play like blackjack and like gamble. Like I'm I'm so like disinterested in actually like doing anything in that game, and I just gamble in it. It's kind of funny. Or what, what, what else do we do in Grand Theft Auto? Uh, I, I go. They're very formulaic streams if you've ever watched them. I go, I drive by the strip club, make some kind of joke about not getting in, then I go and I like. Do a mission or two, and then I spend time uh, going to the casino, and then I leave the casino, and I'll go and I'll like drive around, and then I'll play like tennis and stuff, and then I'll like go back to the casino and sit there for like an hour or two, and I'll drink and play cards. I'm just I'm so disinterested in that game, honestly. It's it's kind of funny actually. And they're super popular too, we'll have like a hundred, like what was that one time? We had like a hundred and fifty people watching me just like, fucking playing cards for an hour and a half, it was ridiculous. I was like, I, I put my like heart into a lot of my work and stuff, and it's just like, it's, it's a Grand Theft Auto casino stream, so that's, that's where it's at. You can get a bowling alley? I wish I had a bowling alley. You've been playing Infinite Wealth, that one's really, really quite good, I've heard. I missed out on that. How am I doing tonight? I'm doing okay, I guess. I mean, I'm, I'm pretty tired today, honestly. I think I call it cherry. Oh, man, if I do. Hope you're doing well. Yeah, we were talking about the dating stuff. Made me feel a little dreary and nostalgic, but uh, other than that, yeah, it's not, not bad in the slightest, yeah. So, well, I guess tired, but yeah, pretty good. User-generated racing maps? Yeah, see, here's the thing, I'm not into that at all. Like, the racing maps, I don't care. It's, I'm just so disinterested in it. It's like, I, the Grand Theft Auto is like, uh, I don't know. I mean, obviously, GTA 6 is gonna be huge, and I'll cover it and play all kinds of stuff, but like... Yeah, I don't know, it's GTA 5, it, it just it feels like a chore whenever I have to stream it, honestly. That's why we rarely do it. Like, it's entertaining, and we never not have a fun time with it, but, like, yeah, I'm just usually completely disinterested in it. Look at the cute little teddy bears! I'm gonna take both of them. They're mine. I'll take this teddy bear, too. Sea turtles. The amazing sea turtles, like Spider-Man. 
keeping me alive. You're welcome, ghoul. Oh, you made me so proud. Yeah. Oh, look, is that a dead sea creature down there? Uh, missed opportunity not to have it in story. Well, of course, right? I mean, the story aspect of having a casino in Grand Theft Auto is a lot of fun, and they probably should have used it. I think there's some missions you can do in multiplayer there, but... Yeah, I, 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 I kind of get it. I get it. I hate this new YouTube streaming thing, too, or this new YouTube UI kills me on the inside. All right, let's let's get focused here. Where are we going now? Step onto the winner stage. All righty. Where is the winner stage? Over there? Is that what the winner stage is, or is it over that way? I don't know where the winner stage is. Do we take the exit? See, this is why I hate when they give you the optional thing, and your quest markers are the exact same, because you literally don't know which quest marker is which. Like, is that where our quest objective is, or is the other one where our quest objective is? And they, they don't tell you. Like, am I going to be walking to the beginning of the map, or am I going towards where my objective is? You literally don't know. I, like, is this the, the exit, or is this... Is it, can this map work? You are here. Mm. <laughs> uh... I feel like I'm backtracking. Well, there's enemies here. I don't think we killed them on the way in. I don't... It's like, they don't tell you where the objective is. You hope I find my soulmate soon. Yeah, thanks, man. I hope so, too, but I'm uh, not getting my hopes up. <laughs> mm. Ah, here. This is it. The winner stage. There's too many of them. Julian, I thought we were getting along when we were beating the few times we've done this storyline. I do wish the expeditions had more of like variety to them. It does feel like you kind of do the same thing on expeditions like over and over again. Oh my god, he's got a... He's got a sludge hammer. I just got sledged. Yeah. Exactly. Love yourself. Yeah, alright. Chrome extension? Yeah, and then I'd have to download a Chrome extension. Is the Fallout TV show worth watching? Yeah, of course it is. It's a great TV show. Did you not watch my review on it? It's pretty spoiler free. It's a really good review. And pretty popular, which I'm very happy about. Alright, so. What are we doing here? Oh yeah, we're killing these guys. I think I need to uh, melee them. She's on fire and not in a good way. Of course, I gotta get in there and be radiated. Let's axe him down! It may be unexpected things when you stop seeking. I don't know, I feel like I've stopped seeking for a while, nothing unexpected has happened. I don't know, just after like years and years and years of stuff, I just don't believe all those like quotes and things people post everywhere. I'm just kinda like, uh, yeah. Look, there's balloons! Ask Mother Charlotte to leave when ready. I'm ready to leave. Is there anything I can, like, take here? I need to go craft ammo. It's what I need. I need freaking ammo. Mother Charlotte, hello there. You must have a secret to keep riding the top. Is she whispering? We'll handle it. Close my eyes and home I go. But I love your undying uh, optimism there, uh, unorthodox, or unlocking paradoxes. It's, it's really nice to see, uh, you know, people there so optimistic on things. It's always uh, heartwarming.
Fallout 4. I, I really love Fallout 4. I kind of want to check out the Fallout London thing, because that mod sounds really cool. So we'll see if we end up doing that or not, because a stream of that would be pretty neat. But it is only on PC, which makes it harder. Is this worth playing this year? There's some pretty good story stuff in this game. And there's some story stuff that's like, eh, but like, it's, it's pretty cool. It's a pretty cool experience, honestly. I, I like it. I didn't like the Atlantic City story stuff, but like, the game itself can be pretty cool. And the base story stuff that comes with it isn't very good, but like, you get through that stuff, it's pretty neat. There's a lot of like, fat around the bow, or around the meat, and the meat's really good. Yeah. I think it's better than some people paint it as, but it was busted when it came out. I need to craft ammo. I need ammo. We didn't even finish the game fast? That's heartbreaking. Hmm. Out here in Vault 76. You know what? I haven't even been back to Vault 76. Can you go inside the vault once you leave? That would be kind of cool. Yeah. Yeah, can you go back into the Vault 76 vault? Because I've always, like, I've walked outside of it before, but I haven't gotten back into it. Hmm. Alright, let's do this. I don't know what we're doing, but we're doing it. And I'm level 60, nice. Lucy, Lucy is the best. Hmm. You don't like, like to take care of your own advice? Ah, uh, don't we all, don't we all. Oh, I leveled up a few times there. Sweet. Yes, I'd like to open my unopened packs. I got all these perks I can't use. Pick a perk. Can I upgrade my charisma ever? Max rank. Okay. All night long. It grows slower at night. But it still doesn't upgrade my actual charisma level. How do I upgrade my actual level level so I can hold more cards? That's what I want to know. What are these P points? I have 90 P points, but I doth not know what they do specifically. Oh, my inventory is over encumbered again? No! I got these teddy bears. 40 millimeter grenades. That would explain it, probably. I don't want to equip it, I want to drink this crap. I just wish you could increase your inventory, because my inventory is like constantly out of space. Constantly out of space. Even with the boosters, it's like always out. Wow, these expeditions are good for leveling. Okay, I just gotta sell some more crap. Is there a way to sort by, like, new? 40mm grenade rounds. Okay, I still have 323. What the hell is taking up all my space? Is it because, like, a, like, the teddy bear stuff? Aristocrat's death tambo? What the hell is that? Okay, those are weird. Zealot chest armor? Look, a million left. Okay. Guess I got armor? Aristocrat armor, okay. I'm out of space in my vending slot to use? Is that what this is? You gotta be kidding me. So I'm just completely out of storage everywhere I look. Oh, yeah, well, I'm just gonna. Is there someone I can sell this crap to? It's just like, it's ridiculous. I'm always out of fucking space in this game. Constantly. Mutant. Right leg. I, I don't have any space for this crap. Can I wear this? It's still gonna take up space in my inventory, isn't it? Right raider arm. Left leg chameleon. A death tambo. That doesn't help me at all. 
crossbow bolts. Get rid of that. Get rid of arrows. 309. Oh my god. Damage. No, I want to get rid of stuff based on weight. Weight, I say. Everyone appears to have died. Yeah, it's it's pretty obvious they're a robot. What about this like weight booster? Is this gonna help me anymore? Takes me up just takes me up to three hundred and ten. Oh my god, I hate this game's management system. It's so fucking garbage. I don't even know how to get rid of stuff really. Like I know I have to sell things, but it's like how do I get rid of things? Come invisible while sneaking and not moving. Well, how much, like, weight does 2.5? 4 weight, 7 weight. Like, I'd love to have the damage resistance, but it just takes up too much weight in my character. Did that help? Yeah, 304 out of 305. Chameleon Scout Leg, did that help? 302. Okay, well, that kind of works. I gotta make armor. The Elder Scrolls TV show? They're not doing an Elder Scrolls TV show. The Howards keep saying no to it. Yeah, he doesn't want it. Oil cards for upgrades? Yeah, that would be nice too if you could get a special card. Anyways, it's been a while. Be sure to like the stream. Subscribing's great. Donations cool. Consider becoming a channel member. Channel member gifting. I don't have any fucking steals. So I can't make any bullets. There's the Patreon option, the Discord for stream alerts, chatter, great times. Also the Amazon Starfleet link if you're into that kind of thing. Use the link in the video description. So all my stuff is too full. All of my things way too much. How do I, how do I, how do I do stuff? Like, how do I do anything? You know what I mean? Like, how do I... Like, I don't have any space, and I can't make space, and it's like I can't sell stuff because I'm too over-encumbered to get to places to sell stuff. It's like, how do I do this, you know? How do I do any of this stuff? Missile launcher. So I guess I take this and I just drop it? A Gatling Plasma? Short flamer, because I mean nobody buys anything. Over encumbered armor chest. Yeah, yeah, then I guess I'll just drop this stuff. That helps with my inventory like slightly. I don't know. Okay, I need steel. Where do I get steel from? How many bullets do I have? Four hundred fifty-six. That's gonna be gone so much fast. I need somebody to just give me bullets. <laughs> I need bullets. Okay. Okay, well, we did those parts of Atlantic City. Should we go do the tax fraud? That's kind of fun. I guess we could go do the tax evasion. I thought we haven't done that 50 million times. Starfield? I'm sure someday Starfield will get like an MMO thing. It's a huge IP. It seems like in the modern era, single player, down the road, multiplayer, and then more single player stuff. Todd Howard Leather Jacket make an appearance in the Fallout series? I don't know, does it? It should in Indiana Jones, I guess. I don't know. Land me down. Take her down. Destroy items? I'm just dropping them to try to get space. It's just it's so frustrating because like, I'm out of space, out of space, and it's like I can't make any ammo or anything. Oh, it just makes me sad. Hmm. All right, let's do this. I'm gonna pull out my flamer though, because I guess there's an achievement for burning these creatures, and I guess I should have been working on that this whole time. I don't know how to describe it. Like, I feel like in this game, I have no items. I can't hold space for new items. I don't have resources to make any items. Ah, uh, Matt Art left the team? Ugh, that guy was carrying us. This game, this game's actually, like, one of their most successful games ever, I guess. I know that sounds odd, but, like, I guess they really did turn it around and, you know, it, it does it really well. It's also really big in Japan for some reason. Yeah, I don't get it either, but this is actually, like, a pretty big hit for them. Lead. I need lead, actually. 
Need to bring lead back home so I can make ammunition. Yeah. See, look, guys, now I have armor. See, that's usually why I don't wear armor in this game, is because it takes up, like, my inventory stuff. Belly Belt Buckles is a cool name. It is actually a pretty cool name. I concur. It's a sweet name. Belly Belt Buckles. I'm actually so sad that guy left us. He was carrying us. What the hell happened there, Filet? You just let me get slapped by a lesser demon from behind? What, what's going on? What, 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 what's up with that? And now I'm down on the ground? Dozen donuts for only $42? It's pretty expensive. A dozen donuts. Dollars twenty-four. Eh, it's actually pretty much the going rate for donuts, isn't it now? <laughs> I love the, the new Coca-Cola gal, it's such a cool advertisement. Oh, I didn't mean to get down here, but I guess we should just go. I mean, you gotta take advantage of your free monthly things. You're almost a diamond member there, homeless bird. Ugh, oh, I've been such a long time, eh? Such a long time. Hmm. Alright, let's go talk to these guys. This is another thing too, is like they have this really cool establishment and they barely like use it. They did use it in the story, but it's like a side mission that you do for like two seconds. I was like a little I was a little disappointed. It's such a relief to see your face around here. Really this guy's kind of annoying to be honest. Same as awesome. But I'm sure. oh. Alright, let's go help Billy Bulb so he's it's the carbon tax. <laughs> yeah, we're screwed by that. Pick up inconspicuous assets and throw them into trucks. Let's do it. Let's do it before this audit happens. Let's get it done, team. I don't know, everything in life is expensive and uh, you just gotta live and accept things and deal with it. <sighs> Glowing plagued rats. Yay. At least this flamethrower burns people alive. Ah, yeah, 308 millimeter. I mean, that doesn't do anything for me, but sure, why not? I need aluminum scraps, I need lead scraps. Pick up inconspicuous assets and toss them onto trucks. Alright, let's get this quest done. I can't really tell how much ammo I'm using to kill these things, but it seems pretty effective. What are you doing, Flay? You gotta pick up the garbage and throw the garbage in the thingy. How do I drop them in here? I love how it's an audit, quote unquote. I feel like I should be using my guns for these people and shooting them. Can't remember how you throw this stuff, or is it automatically thrown? the wrong button. I keep pressing the B button to crouch, and it's not that. Just my luck. Just my luck. I think I have these uh, repair kits. Otherwise, I wouldn't even know what to do in this game if I didn't have repair kits. I'd just be screwed. Are bagels just as bad? I don't know about bagels. I think they, bagels have gotten more expensive, but I don't really eat bagels. Fucking hell, there's a lot of enemies.
I gotta be out of bullets. Can I buy bullets? Like, do people sell them? Oh, man. I'm gonna miss that other guy. He was so helpful. I'm hoping someone else randomly joins and, like, carries us home. Because some of this stuff's pretty tough. How do you drop them? I don't really remember. I think you kind of pick them up and then you just kind of throw them, if I'm not mistaken. I think they're, like, throwables. Oh, yeah, they're, like, uh... They're, they're like... I totally forgot. You throw them like grenades. Yeah, you throw the garbage like grenades. That's what it is. Yeah, they're, they're grenades that you throw. That's what it is. There's a lot of these auditor punishers. I didn't realize they take took auditing so seriously in the apocalypse. I mean, money is important, but like, Jesus. This flamethrower actually kicks ass. I'm getting all these stim packs, which is kind of bringing me new hope. Can Nikki? Yeah, that's the guy that usually like carries us. We had a guy in here. I don't know if he was from the stream, but there was a guy in here earlier that was uh, kind of carrying us a bit on these segments. I'm leveling up, but leveling up in this game doesn't seem to really do anything. Come on, Flay, throw your freaking thing in there so we get this done. Ugh. Pick up inconspicuous assets. I thought I already did. The second one, maybe it just glitched. That's probably what it is. The opening for the Fallout episode. I'd say, oh, fucking Christ, this game. Yeah, you know, all the update stuff's pretty good. You forgot I was streaming? Damn, super. You really need to lay off the drinks. Fallout show compares to The Witcher or The Last of Us. I I like the Fallout show show more than the The Last of Us. I actually think it's more impressive because it's like they're not just adapting the story; they're actually making like a new like narrative and it's it's great and yeah so I, I actually like it more ah. <laughs> I'm just getting killed here dude these, these guys are ridiculous absolutely ridiculous alright let's keep doing this again if you guys have the game and you're better that, than I am you should jump in and, and carry us here Build the dump. We haven't done a single dump truck? Oh my god. There's multiple dump trucks. I swear I keep throwing them in there. I don't know why they're not counting. Like, look at all the guys. Like, I've killed these guys like seven times over, it feels like. Like, I guess I'm gaining XP by doing this, but... Is it glitched? Is that why it's not counting? I don't know. Oh, hey, Barry. Hope you're doing well. The series is pretty good. You watched the first episode. Uh, you got a lot of good episodes ahead of you, man. You're gonna have a lot of fun with it. Yeah. Oh, don't worry, Supa. He's he's a career drinker. He's he knows to eat and everything like that. It's zero. That kid, you gotta make sure he's eating and stuff. Yeah. Supa's a big boy. He knows what he's doing. <laughs> Yeah. I'm killing so many of these people. They got flamethrowers too? Fuck me, man. Oh, this is killing me. I'm giving it my all. We got a hard respawn? That's odd. That's what I'm saying is like these quests sometimes make this like not fun. I was like, oh I wanna do an easy I should have just done like COD's night. I just wanted an easy go and kinda like night. But I wanted to like, you know, tie it into Fallout, and that's that's how we got here today. Yeah. They all have flamethrowers too. You think they'd stop spawning at some point?
Alright, so that counted. We got one more to get in there. It's just me burning people. Enter the Neapolitan. Okay, is that this one or is that the other casino? Is this the Neapolitan thing? Or is this a different casino? Alright, let's go in here. Yeah, Supa's always living and stuff. Zero's, Zero just got into wine. He's not always a wine drinker. He's, he just got into it. He's uh, he's at that age where he was just able to drink, so he's kind of experimenting with trying to find out what he likes and stuff. It's, it's actually really fascinating. It takes me back to my, my younger self and all that, too, when you, you first get into it. At least he's got more guidance than that. I kind of just had to figure it all out for drinks by myself, honestly. Which is fascinating. Because I was like the eldest of people I knew. So like... Well, not the eldest. There's one guy that was slightly... Like literally a week, I think. Did he have a week? No, he was a week after me. Yeah, I was. I was the oldest. So I was like, I experienced all the drinking stuff. Four of my friends, and it was kind of cool though. I got to go to everyone as they turned 18's birthdays. It was it was fun. I don't talk to any of those people anymore. Purge the accounting terminals. This area was cool in the story mode. I did I did appreciate what they did with this area. I need the desk fan. I need to collect these items so I can build stuff in my camp. See, that's the thing is I want to build stuff in my camp, but I can't because I don't have any stash space. Friggin' sucks, man. Purge the accounting records from terminals. Don't we have to do that here? Isn't that in this environment, or...? Yeah, we have to do that here, I think. These guys, I need to burn a hundred of them for an achievement. They've been doing that the last few streams, but, you know, whatever, I guess I missed it. You super your wife and your best friend? That's what I want. A wife and a best friend. And bulk snacks. <laughs> the trading card game. Well, it's not a trading card game, but bulk snacks the game. Okay, here we go, the accounting terminal. Okay, tests. Tests has one so posed. No, that's not it. Deal. God damn it. You dead again, Filet? Filet is always dying. Oh, it's a nice motivational story about Supa and his love. God damn it. I hate these freaking terminal things, man. I'll figure this out. I got this. I got this, guys. James? It's James Bond, isn't it? No, it's not. One likeness. Zero likeness. Freaking hell. Uh... It's just like luck. Is there a way to increase my skills for hacking? Because this is traumatic every time I have to stream and kind of like guess what it's going to be. Come on. Okay, let's do this. Because, I mean, theoretically, you could be at this all night. Zero likeness. Clans? Got it. Alright, so there's still three more terminals to go. Where's the other one? Inside the objective area, but I already used this one. Alright, so that one's done. Are they all in this room? That wouldn't make any sense. They're, they wouldn't all be in this room, would they? Hmm. 
says we're inside the objective area. I'm looking for these stupid terminals. What are these payout terminals? Oh, there's wine in here? I'll take that. I'm over encumbered. God damn it. I knew I shouldn't have taken that wine. Can I drink it? There we go. I'm no longer over encumbered. Is this the area? No, I left the area. It says there's inside the objective area. Looking for a terminal. Is this game sure? Because, I mean, I just did a terminal, unless there's a second terminal in here I'm missing. Yeah, we did this one. Maybe it just thinks that this is part of that. Okay, let's keep looking here. Yeah. <laughs> YouTube party chat from another time. Yeah. I heard they met at a hopeless place. <laughs> like that Rihanna song. Well, that terminal's not working. I swear there's like the terminals are like different offices, aren't they? Is this one? Billy's personal computer. I don't think this is the one, is it? Password is password. Okay, that doesn't help me. We need to cleanse more terminals, but I don't know where they are. This game has like the worst system for like letting you know where shit is. It's like <sighs> purge the accounting records from the terminals. Are the terminals all in one room and I've just like missed somehow all of them? Is, is that what it's trying to tell me? Is they're all in that room? Y you know what I mean? There's spawn killing you? Where are they spawn killing you? I feel spawn killed because you're not sitting there liking the stream. Haha, -ha. subscribing's great, donations cool, consider becoming a channel member. Channel member gifted, the Patreon option, the Discord for stream alerts, chatter, and okay times. Also, an Amazon store fleet link. Grab anything on Amazon, use the link in the video description. I guess I need to go help Filet because I guess he keeps getting spawn killed somehow. I don't know how that's possible, but. All right, let's let's go save Filet's life, I guess. That's how we get to the next areas. The sticky fingers is over there. Oh my god, this the directional finding in this game is terrible. All right, let's go see where Filet is. Someone's here. Run, Flay, run while I distract them. Get out of here and go look for the terminals. As Flay just stands there. Oh my god. Just run, Flay. Just go to the basement and get all the terminals done. Because I'm tired of looking for terminals. I'll kill these guys. I'll do the heavy lifting. The wine has worn off, but I like the wine. I don't want it to wear off. He died again, Flay? Oh my god. How do you keep dying? Get good. Hmm. Oh, this is really nice to see the Fallout show so popular. I was doing my like review and I was like, this is really, really, really good. And I'm like, am I the only one that's gonna think this is really, really, really good? Holy crap, that guy's got a rocket launcher. I don't know how many times that's happened where I'm just kind of like really worried reviewing something that like my thoughts are going to be like way off of people's. But it's nice to see that other people felt the same way. Hey, Bert. Yeah. Down you go. Is 
Don't forget to collect all the fuel. I need fuel to kill more guys and stuff. You know how it is. How's it coming on purging those records, Filet? You got them all purged yet? Because I'm purging these people from their lives. I think this is good XP. I'm not too sure, really, but yeah, I think somewhat good XP, right? There's a lot of bodies up here. You think this whole place would be engulfed in flames? Yeah, I think they're all dead. I think I literally killed all of them. Good for me. Yeah. Hmm. Hey, look, rum. I'm over encumbered because I drank rum? That doesn't make sense. Oh, now I'm not over encumbered, I don't think, because I drank the rum. Good, 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 good. Alright, well, let's, let's crack this door, guys. I like the lockpicking system. Works pretty well. Yeah. Hmm. Chemistry station. Ooh, cap stash. Nice. <laughs> it's like, what is attacking me? And it's like, oh, there's a rad a rad roach. It's like, okay. Records expunged. Okay, we got one more records to expunge, guys. Whatever that is. I'm on the hunt. Is it over here? That must be down here. Okay, let's expunge these records. Let's get it done. They met on Instant Messenger? Okay, that's interesting. Like MSN Messenger? Ooh, month. What's similar to month? Alone? No. Alone was not similar to month. We need to go save belly bu belt buckles or whatever his name is. My flamer is broken. Fuck my life. Good thing there's no friendly fire burning here. Weed whack him, Filet! Weed whack him! This guy just keeps fucking healing himself, he's invincible. Hey, he's gotta be glitched. There's, there's no way he keeps, like, healing like this. Like, are you fucking kidding me right now? <laughs> like, are you seeing this? I don't think he could be killed. I, I'm, I'm leaving this guy. He's he's invincible. I he, he can't be killed. <laughs> like, 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 are you seeing this? Oh, holy man! He's just burning alive. Freaking hell! Just sitting, just burning this plant, and it's just like, oh, he's like, you'll never kill me. I'm just like, oh man, that's crazy. Ugh. Hot damn. Let's see what Mitchell's doing. Oh, he's posting some stuff. He's still skating, you know, Mitchell. He's just he's skating his heart out there. Yeah, it's kind of fascinating. Okay, so this is the back entrance way into that place we need to go because we gotta go fight some guy. Yeah. 
Maybe he's not bugged. Maybe he's just a very powerful creature. Did you ever think about that? Did you ever think he's more powerful than you ever could imagine? Hmm. All right, let's go fillet. It's going to get really nasty in here. Someone is going to die. Okay, I'm going to kill some of these secondary guys. They, uh, they knocked us down pretty fast, yeah. Swamp thing, more like invincible thing. Whew. I don't know, I sometimes feel like this game, a little grindy. You know what I mean? A little, little grindy. Uh, grenades, flame grenades, okay. <sighs> I feel like it's almost better giving this guy up to these guys. Freaking hell, you know what I mean? You do a pen tip of damage. Did you think about getting good there, Flay? Level 36, you're leveling up pretty fast in here. It's like your power leveling off my ass. Holy. There's a mine in here? Fuck, do they ever stop? Fallout 4 update will give the game a bump? Yeah, probably. I mean, that's what you do, is you try to coordinate your games and your shows all together. It's brand synergy. It's what PlayStation does with all their stuff, and it helps a lot. Yeah, so doing the show plus having, you know, the game updates and stuff kind of together, it's, it's a great idea, honestly. I actually think they were kind of stupid for not uh, getting it all out at the same week, honestly. I don't want the missiles, they make me over encumbered. Ah, oh, goddammit. I've lost all my stims? I spent the whole level collecting stims and now they're gone again. Ugh. And for what? I'm over encumbered? You gotta be kidding me. This fucking game is so annoying sometimes. Uh Seriously, man, it's so annoying. Alright, there we go. Okay, let's go kill Buttercup. I think I can just axe this guy a bunch and he dies eventually. It seems like he's pretty impervious to, like, damage. Okay, this is fucking ridiculous. Like, look at the damage this guy's taking. I think how I killed him last time was just axing him. Yeah, he's, he's taken that pretty, pretty intensely too. Keep occasional shots on him, Flay, in case I die so he doesn't get a health revamp. I don't think weed whacking him is gonna do anything. I'm gonna have no ammo left. This game is its just like, it's spongy, all your ammo constantly is gone. None of the other fallouts feel like this, where you're like constantly out of crap. You know what I mean? Like, fucking hell, man. It's like I'm playing The Division. But it's Fallout. 
You see this crap? Hmm. Did The Witcher 3 update come out before or after the show? The, the Witcher game had nothing really to do with the show from what I recall. I like to think that full time I'm out there looking for love. Looking for the right gal. We got it. We're gonna get Buttercup, guys. He's gonna die eventually. I wish I had a gun that could do more damage. The sad thing is, at the end of this, we don't even kill Buttercup, he just, like, walks away. He's not even faced. Playing Elden Ring. Hmm. I think technically Filet being in here makes it easier, doesn't it? Yeah, licensing for racing games is expensive, but they could have made the crew available offline for people, right? Apparently it is a setting in that game to just flick a switch and make it available offline. You know. Oh, well that was a hell of a time. We got a free Billy. Where is Billy? Through you, Buttercup. Tell Billy of my triumphs. I want to watch Buttercup. Usually he just like runs away really randomly, you don't even notice. Is he gone already? Same time next week, Billy. Alright, uh, let's go talk to Lenox and get out of here. Oh, that was a hell of a battle. Oh, there goes all my ammo. Where's that guy that's supposed to join in and drop like 10,000 bullets for me? I need that hero. Did it crash? Please don't tell me you crashed on me, game. No, no, it's just loading. Okay, good. For a second there, I was really worthy. It cost everything in your inventory. Yeah, it cost everything in my inventory, too, basically. Holy. Just spongy. Alright, let's get to Lenox so we can blow this popsicle stamp. Hmm. I right, get me out of here, Lenox. You ready to get airborne? Bet my uh, or your ass I am. Right, I'll be back in a sec. I gotta do something. <laughs> One sec.
Pax Evasion's complete. Ah. Scribe Valdez? Nah, Scribe Valdez never comes back again. She's gone forever, but forever in our hearts, and in your guys' likes on the stream. So be sure to like the stream, subscribing's great, donations cool, consider becoming a channel member. Channel member gifting, the Patreon option, and the Discord for stream alerts, chatter, and great times. There's also the Amazon store affiliate link. If you're into that kind of thing. No, but they can update their existing game and not charge for it and just make it available offline for the crew. That would solve everyone's problems because apparently there's, like, allegedly there's a switch on the back end that just makes it an offline game, I guess. I don't know. And with that, you wouldn't necessarily have to pay for licensing or anything, right? Oh, man. Beat. <laughs> Aye. Right. Confetti party! I'm over encumbered. Again. Can I at least make bullets, please? Please, can I make bullets? Ugh, I can't make any bullets. I need steel? Oh, man. You're just dropping cake things? Good for you. A grenade launcher. Or like a grenade taking up space. Scout's code teamwork makes the dream work. So I have a Z-Lot multi-purpose level 45. This is the exact same thing. Okay. Okay, and I still have my Z-Lot thing in my inventory. Juggernaut fire axe. Oh no, it's the same thing. Hey, what's the fire axe worth? Level 35? Well, I want that new axe. Where'd that axe go? There we go. So now I got a new axe. So I can ask people a question. Life-saving armor thing. Raider left armor. I'm gonna get rid of that crap. Play, you can have anything I throw on the ground. It's all yours. <laughs> There we go, I'm not over encumbered anymore. Alright, okay, so let's see. Is there anything on the map we can do that would be a fun mission? Breach and clear. I need that for that achievement, right? Breach and clear? Yes, okay. Let's go do breach and clear. Let's do it. But I don't have any bullets or any ammo. And I'm all out of love. You guys really gotta stop bringing up love and, and romance on the channel. It just, you know, it breaks my heart, honestly. <laughs> People always gotta bring that up, and it's just sad. Wait till I find someone great in life, and then we can talk about this all the time. Alright, let's see. I got a gun with low ammo. What is happening? Clear the area of hostiles. Okay. Level 50 mole rats. They sure are taking a lot of bullets, like they not even, they're bullet sponges. Do I have any stim packs left? I don't have any stim packs left, cause I used 15 stim packs fighting fucking Buttercup. <laughs> There's like 25 camera score on the line. Okay, who's shooting me with the Gun. I didn't know what the mole people like. Hey, that guy just capped me in the face with that shotgun. You need ammo? I need ammo. This game is so freaking tediously obnoxious. I never have any bullets. <laughs> I never have any supplies. My inventory is over encumbered. I don't have any space in my stash. There's nobody to sell things to. It's so annoying. Everything in this game is just like a complete pain in the ass. <laughs> ah. Okay, let's just see if the flamer can freaking burn these guys. I'm 
out of everything, and I'm not happy about it. Just goes to show you can work really hard and things can still not work out for you. You know what I mean? I just got an icon thing. I don't know what that means. I just bullet burned a whole bunch of mole people. Did they deserve it? Yes. Was I happy doing it? Yes. Okay, Filet, get out of here and help me kill all these mole people. I only got a minute and 20 left. I want to get this achievement. Clear the area of hostiles. Are there hostiles inside? I've only got a minute left. I don't I don't see any hostiles. Yeah, forty five seconds. I want my achievement. A glowing mole miner? Give me my achievement mole, man. How many fucking mole people are there? <laughs> my depression arc. I feel like my depression arc has lasted years. It all goes back. There's three enemies left in 19 seconds? No! Ah! Run! Run, 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 run! I'm killing them as fast as I can. Fuck! <laughs> Where were you, Filet? I needed to kill three guys. <laughs> God damn it. <sighs> yeah, the heart emote. Great, I missed out on this achievement again. Lovely. <sighs> Monster Mash. Is that a quest up here? We were so close! Test your metal. Dog off, die off. Anyways, I, th I think my depression arc uh, started with that one gal was a fucking problem a few years back. Oh, God. Should we try to find another, like, lobby? Like, is there... We have an expeditions lobby. I'm just like wondering if we join. Well, these guys have an expeditions lobby. Can we join these guys? Like they're oh they're offline. They're offline. Event test your metal. Cause I'm just like wondering, can we like join like a different server and like there'd be different people in it that could like join us? All right, let's go back to camp. And then I'm thinking if we set up a different server, maybe some other people could join. You were riding the hot dog. Uh, of course you were riding the hot dog fillet. Oh god, yeah. <laughs> of course. Remember guys, have a great day. It's a good day to have a good day. Uh, okay, so... Like, is, is there an easier way? Daily Ops Decryption. I feel like we get our asses kicked doing this. Oh, uh, initiate here. Because I'm like, I'd rather have some new people that could join our team. Because none of these guys are joining. Who's in this lobby? Like, are these guys in our lobby? Because I'm like, if we join a new squad, can they join this? Do physical activities, yoga, spin, kickboxing. Yeah, I mean, that'd be fun. Okay, we're gonna we're going to join a new server. I don't know the fastest way to do that. But I think... I think I gotta quit and then just rejoin and then we'll have like a new server which fallout fallout 76 i've heard you go to events to meet people and stuff but it's just like oh usually pretty busy i know which is a terrible excuse but it's like a lot of people they go to work and they have things they need to go to to go to right to meet people and i don't have those things because <laughs> I, I do work from home so it's just like he has got to run into people. On walks, I've actually, like, met some pretty cool people, but nothing's ever panned out from that.
Yeah, it's, it's just life, honestly. I'm sure at some point I'll get lucky again. Yeah, here we go. We got a new thing. Now I'm over encumbered again? What the fuck? Look. 149 out of 132 health. Okay. Not over encumbered. Alright, so I will create a social. So there's no teams here at all? I will create an expeditions team. Because we want to go expedite in the thing. Event project on the horde. Dog would die off. Find the location of the fort defense. Okay. Let's see. I don't know how to invite Flay. Flay, you, you can figure out your own way back in here. ZOI, join the team. Nice. Okay, we're, we're rolling. I don't know where he is. I forgot I still don't have steel. So I can't. I don't got any bullets. Okay. Well, we should go do... We should go do an event before this guy leaves and thinks we're not doing expeditions. Right? Yeah, that's what we should do. We should go do an event before he leaves. Let's do the pit. And the trench? Or, yeah, let's go do the trench. And hopefully this guy joins with us. Get in here, Filet. Come get carried by this level 400. <laughs> he knows what he's doing. He's not a quitter. He's a winner. Unless he quits as soon as we start this because he wanted to do a different mission. Then I'll be like, No! And I'll be like, I saw that coming. The pit from ashes to fire. Should we, like, see if this guy joins in here before we land, or... Ah, he's joining. Oh, she's joining. Hello! I love your eye patch, which has an eye through the eye patch. That's what I'm talking about. I have a vault package that has steel. Why didn't you tell me that before? Before I went on this expedition. Vault package that has steel. God damn it, because that would be my stash. The next time I'm in my stash, I'll have to try to remember to do that. Seriously though, Flay, come in here and get some of this sweet, sweet XP. You only got 93 flame ammo? Oh god. Ooh, what is this? What is that? Her power armor makes her become an alien? Well, that doesn't make any sense. Oh, there we go. Let's expedition. Pay to survive in the Appalachia. Seriously, though, it just feels like I'm constantly out of resources. I feel like I'm starved for tools and items. Let's make contact with Danilo. Blah 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 Thank you, Danilo. Go to Jackson's house. Where's Jackson's house? The other thing is this person we're playing with probably does this like nine times a day. They're probably like this filthy casual. This filthy level 63 casual. Well they have like days of time in this game and I'm like don't be casual in this. Hmm. A fanatic troublemaker? A fanatic death? person who's dead because I killed them because they were a fanatic. Oh, this is where we're headed. Hmm. Yeah, I was, because I was sitting there and I was like, man, all of my Fallout videos, specifically Fallout 76 on PS5, got like a huge bump up in views. I was wondering what happened and I was like, ah, oh, that explains it. it. Explains it a lot. I'm not kidding, man. If, like, if you want to get like good XP boosts, these freaking... 
things, they, the expeditions give you so much XP. And this guy's just gonna carry you through. But I wonder why they want to join. Is it because it's easier because they're with me or something? I don't. I don't really get that. It's like, why would you want to play with a lower level, honestly? Unless it's, like, easier for them. Yeah. I need to stab the trogs. I need to kill, I think, 100 of them or something without shooting. Let me check that. What is a trog? 100 trog. Oh, with an auto axe. Oh, I don't have an auto axe. Never mind. Multi purpose axe. Alright, let's carry on. Hmm. I leveled up. That's what I'm talking about. Uh, this person's like just killing everyone, and uh, you know what? I'm loving it. What I'm not loving is the uh, radiation poisoning that I'm getting here. Not fun. Not fun at all. Uh, the superior drug is, uh, as the title would suggest, uh, superior. 38? Oh, like, freaking hell, Filet's actually power level while playing with Rumi. You've barely, like, played the game and you've found these kind of crazy levelings going on. It's ridiculous. It's actually pretty impressive. Oh, I need some right away. I guess that's why they're in the power armor, right? It's so that they don't get radiated. And it also looks cool. Fucking hell, these drugs are tough. I need your fuel, thank you. I need more time. That's a radiation sound, guys. Yeah, hop on 76. We, technically, we have one space left in our team if anyone else has this. Seriously. Honestly, don't mind. The only thing I mind is getting you guys to like the stream. Subscribing is great. Donations, cool. Consider becoming a channel member, channel member gifting, the Patreon option, the Discord for stream alerts, chatter, and great times. There's also an Amazon store if you're like, into that kind of thing. There goes all my fucking ammo. Wait, can I take Rad X and then I don't increase this Rad resistance? Yeah, that's what I'm looking for. We should have exciting stuff because Filet there gifted or it was a gamer's remorse, whatever his weird name was on that one. Gifted uh, the Suicide Squad game, so I guess we'll be streaming that over the next couple of days. Out of stim packs. Sucks, this suck. I see you, Flay. Let's go, team. The effect is carrying us home tonight. Hmm. 
How the hell did I get so far ahead? Is it the power suit? We had to go kill the fanatic. That guy's pretty tough, dude. Are we taking these extra quests? I mean, I don't really care about them. Yeah, you see you later, Avarose. Live in the, the mines here. Ah, this person really seems to know what they're doing. It's kind of impressive. Hmm. It was supposed to be two days ago, that's funny. Oh, I think we got like another sponsored stream coming up on Tuesday, so I'm, I'm pretty excited about that. So, you guys should be there on Tuesday. Be there, be square. Or at least watch it afterwards. And, you know, give it a view and click the weird thingy that they ask you to click and... You know how it is. Gotta subsidize these streams, and you know, money's cool and all that. <laughs> Let's go, team. What's the level achievement? Is it level 100 you get an achievement, or is it a different one? Enter the Sanctum. A pleasure. Hmm. I don't know. We'll we'll see how good Suicide Squad is when I finally get to play it. There was a few times I was circling around for codes on that one, and it just never really worked out. I tried. I really did. Sometimes people say I try too hard for people and things. Ah, right, let's go, team. Leave or die. I think I'm gonna die in here, to be honest. That's okay. I'll just respawn. I don't want to be a burden to our teammates, so it's, it's okay if I just respawn. Oh. This is wherever this target is. Oh yeah, we're collecting colors, I guess, as a secondary thing. That is a very well-preserved Nuka-Cola fridge. You would think the artwork would all be gone at this point. I don't understand, am I supposed to magically have a better gun for killing these things or something? Man, they just, like, eat ammo. A super stim pack? Nice. Where is the Zoe effect at? Is he in this area? Is she in this area or is she somewhere else? Oh, she's running around. Okay. I guess she's an alien right now, technically. Oh, there's Tato's. Nom 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 nom. All right. <laughs> Nonchalant about everything in here. Not I'm over encumbered. I can't run anyways. I actually think this game would be unplayable without me having like 160 of these uh, weight boosters. I've only got 70 bullets. Our teammate probably thinks we're so useless. The warden is dead? Oh, well that was easy.
I didn't even get some fuel from that. That's ridiculous. Ooh, loose springs. Nice. Hmm. Hey, was there somebody in this fridge? Ew. Free laborers from their cells? What laborers are there? Oh, they're all down over there. Free them. Free them, filet. Free the laborers. Just gonna run right by that turret, because ain't nobody got ammo for that crap. I don't want to fight those things. Hmm. So those guys are all over there. I should probably try to catch up, I guess. Yay, we're freeing the prisoners. I'm out of stims again? I thought I just picked up a super stim. Because the super stim wasn't so super. Yeah. A lot of floating screens should be in this ugly swimsuit. Why? DCU. Yeah, I decided not to do the stream for the DCU thing. I decided I was just going to take the W on how successful the video was. Holy food. Yum. Yeah, I decided to just take a take a W on that. We have to return the collars? Who the fuck got time for that? Return the collars. Oh she's escape. All the captives were I've got a pro remember. Blah 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 blah. Blah 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 blah. Yeah, I'll just wait till they do the Xbox update for DCU or whatever. I'll do a stream for it then. I've got no bullets. Where is Zoyu handling in? I want, I'm wondering if Zoyu is handling in all of the trackers or something like that. I don't know if we're supposed to follow them or if they're coming over here or not. I do wish the Fallout games kind of had a little bit better of a mapping thing, so we kind of at least situationally knew where our like where our teammates are going, what they're doing. Be very helpful. Or are they going another way to get over here? Oh, they they went a different way. Well, it sucks being here at the basement, then, while the squad's up at the top. I hate when I fall behind like this. Pulley's <laughs> just sleeping. Yeah, I'm sure our teammate's gonna be real impressed by that. Probably already thinks we're greatly incompetent. At least we get a three times bonus, because we're together. I got five levels to do. So you gotta let our teammate do some of the kills, and then I can collect fuel. Yeah. Pick a perk. I always pick Charisma, but it never gives me Charisma.
How many of these things do I have? I like a lot of cards it's giving me. <gasps> One unused agility point. Oh my god. 40% more crafting ammunition? That's what I'm talking about. Hmm. Lucky break, farmer care. Actually, did I do that properly, or did I get, a, get rid of a good perk in my thing? What did I just get rid of? Oh, okay. <gasps> I knocked the mannequin down! I'm a monster. Tracking data destroyed. We're totally helping our teammate here. It's a team effort. The cocktail is a lie. He just flew over there? God, that's cool. Well, it was a joke because the story we did last time, it was saying cocktails coming soon, so I, I doubt they ever updated that. You know, it just wasn't in the economic uh, outlines, right? Cocktails are expensive. Can we, like, free these people from the stocks? Oh, we can. You're welcome! God, the pit is a hellhole. Was he the foreman? He's dead? Oh. That guy took me, like, 20 minutes to kill. Oh, no, that's the foreman. You got back up? I wonder if this character on our team just knows how, like, constantly out of ammo I am. I'm critically injured. I got back up, nice. Let's get the hell out of this place. Hold possum? Uh, how the hell do we get out of here? How much inventory space do I have? 297, because I'm like, I could use a fan or two. <laughs> you know, for crafting stuff, right? Crafting supplies? Let's get these to this guy's shortcut and get out of here. I think I went the wrong way. Oh! This is kind of funny because it's like going down that alleyway with all the turrets. It's like, ooh. Fallout first is 60% of. And that's a pretty good deal if you're into it, right? I just like not that into it, if that makes sense. But it's cool, but yeah, no. It's all subscriptions. Microsoft, they, they love subscriptions. Every company loves subscriptions right now because it just shows good guaranteed value, right? 
It's like a new way of, of finance guarantee. Feeble survivor, middling survivor, and resilient survivor. Rescue all the helpless survivors. He's got time for that crap. How do we get out of this godforsaken hellhole? Fucking Christ, am I getting irradiated. Oh my god. I have mutated and gained eagle eyes. I need to get out of this storm, I'm fucking dying. <laughs> I'm getting radiated. Do I need nuclear waste? What do we do with nuclear waste? Glowing meat. Yum. Is this why he's got the rad suit on? So he doesn't have to deal with the rad stuff? Flay, your, your radiation is killing you. You're gonna die of rad poisoning. Did you consider using rad away or bad X? I take it the Zoe effect person knows where they're going. Ooh, that was my last stim. <sighs> the hell are they going? I'm just trying to like keep up with this person and they are hopping around for their lives. that would at least tell me if that's the exit or is this person saving people over there where the fuck are they <laughs> like I'm chasing after them to try to help and this, this is just madness Radiation poisoning is just like ridiculous here. Oh, please tell me this is like the exit. They're towards the exit. Blast radius of the board game. That's good. Okay, hey, this this appears to maybe be a way out of this hellhole. The pit really is a crappy place. I'd rather go back to the Atlantic City boardwalk. Learn more of the creatures that are swamp monsters. I guess we could do that again. That would be pretty good. It would also be good to get you guys to take a second to like the stream. Subscribing's great. Donations cool. Consider becoming a channel member. Channel member gifting. The Patreon option. The Discord for stream alerts, chatter, and okay times. Also an Amazon Starfleet link if you're into that kind of thing. Ah, right, here we go. Hey, Danilo. You're welcome. If you come back. Let's get the fuck out of here. 
You ready to get Take me home, Lennox. Take me home. I mean, now that we got this higher character, we might be able to get and kill those things fast, right? Assuming Zoe effect doesn't leave us because of our bad performance, but I don't know. I think it's just good XP, isn't it? Surprised there's no event where people are killing a dragon or something. It's usually really popular. I guess we can check and see if Breach and Clear is available. I'd love to get that achievement. Yeah, I'd love to get Breach and Clear. That would be fun. It would be a nice 25 gamer score, I think. 20 gamer score. Something like that. Hmm. Out here in Vault 76. Wonder what kind of weird musical segment they're gonna come up for that one. That would be fun. They've always got something going on when they show off these new updates, right? They have a big musical thing. Ah, we got someone else to join the team. Nice. And I'm over encumbered again. Fuck me. And he left the team immediately. Okay. Two shot minigun. Like, I guess. I don't I got room for any of this crap. Pipe pistol, 0.38. Might actually keep that. I need right away. So does filet, apparently. Holy crap. Do I have a pistol I can get rid of for 0.38? Short laser no. pistol over no. 35. Oh no, everyone appears to have died. This is terrible. Reaching clear? Nope. Listening. Dropping to catastrophic levels. Okay, our teammate has not ditched us. I think we should set up the Atlantic City flooded city and do that again. Before they leave us. Battle Spire. <laughs> that one's a big sword. It was fun checking out those older games. I do wish they were more popular. Like, it must be really cool to have a channel, like, on YouTube where you're, like, just massive. And whatever you do is just, like, pretty popular. And you can, like, really play anything and have, like, weird stuff that people are excited about. Yeah, it must be pretty sweet. Ugh. <sighs> Pretty sweet indeed. Alright, let's see if anybody joins me. I might be the only one on this quest. I don't know yet. Oh, they did leave us! Fuck! Okay, can I can I back out? Zoe effect, no! You were supposed to be our savior. Oh, that sucks. Did they not want to do this mission? Were we so bad that they didn't want to play with us? That makes me sad. I'm gonna request the landing and then leave the expedition because I, I, I don't think we can do this again. Can't handle the emotional turmoil. Why would you forsake us, Zoe? Why? Fall 76 admin. Okay, yeah. Uh, how do I leave the expedition? Lenox, get me out of here. Here we are. Don't you worry about it. Is there a way to leave the expedition, or am I just stuck here? Do I have to do this? Is, is there no way to get out of the expedition? Oh, someone's doing daily ops? Fuck, I wish we could join that. Oh, Zoe Effect left us to go do daily ops. Oh, that's rough. I, I I accept that. That makes sense to me. How do I get out of here? Can I, can I not leave the expeditions? Am I stuck in the expedition? Ah, oh. I don't know if you can leave expedition. Leave expedition. In the menu, you should see abandoned expedition near the top. You won't need a gun anymore. I don't see that anywhere. 
That was three years ago. Open the map and pick White Spring as a definition. Oh, I can just fast travel? Oh, okay. That's easy. Go back to camp. Because it's like, I, I don't know if we can do that without a team. I don't really want to do it without a team. Uh, finish my job, but I don't want the giant creatures that are overpowered to slaughter us. Please just here enjoyed my my great place. Yeah, right, so allegedly I have a backpack that gives me stuff, I think. I don't know where it is. Junk. Is it junk? Life preserver? Is there like a new area? New. Crap, what is that called that I was supposed to get? Apparently I have a gift bag. What, what was that gift bag called, Filet, that we were we, we got? Oh, no. It has metal in it? Oh. Yeah, it's not any of this stuff. Is it considered junk? I have a lot of junk because apparently we got a bag of stuff from the update to this game and I don't know what it's called. Okay, tall flask. We wore money. I, I don't see what it is. You're the ghoul from the TV show? That's cool, man. This, this thing, medium vault supply package. Small vault supply package. I got a tons of these? Really? What, what are these? Hm. Apparently I have a lot of supply packages. I cannot equip this item. Well, how do I use it? How the fuck do you use this then if you can't equip it? Do you drop it? Okay. How do I open the packages, though? You scrap them. Oh, okay. Scrap items. Oh. I am so goddamn over encumbered, aren't I? Yeah, I'm super over encumbered. Does that mean I can make bullets? Oh, can I make bullets? I can't make 10 millimeter bullets. I can make 21 of them, that's it? Or is that like sets of bullets? I'm 337 over encumbered. Why am I so over encumbered? I'm gonna steal scrap. Fuel fusion cells. I don't have space in my inventory. Wood scraps. My stash box is full. Well, how? Do I empty stuff from my uh, my thing, right? Auto stim, regenerating stim, level forty, level forty. Are these the same things? Raider power torso, chameleon power torso. Yeah, 
got so much crap. It's like, how do you, what do you do with all this stuff? Seriously though, like, what do you do with all this crap you collect in this game? It's all pretty useless. Oathbreaker, God, that sounds so cool. Got this Hellcat armor and stuff. My stash box is full again. It's like nine of this is like I spend like 20 minutes of this game just doing like freaking resource management. Oh, it's free crap if you want to grab it here, Filet. Once I get rid of it all. Alright, now can I put the waste oil in here? There's still not space left? You've got to be kidding me! You've got to be kidding me! Uh, I don't want to have my own place. What a headache that would be. It should be like a, a cellar that you can have at your house. That would be great. Because I don't think I can fast travel with this stuff, and it would be nice to sell it to make some money, you know what I mean? Get rid of all this crap. Because I, I think there's like a store I can go to, but I don't think I can fast travel to it. Breach and Clear is live? God damn it! I need to do Breach and Clear! I need to do Breach and Clear fast before the time runs out, okay. There you go, and enjoy this crap filet. I gotta go and fight these moles. So let's do it. You're resting at a bonfire? That would be nice. What are you talking about Dark Souls? I wanna have, like, bonfire nights. That'd be lovely. Ugh. <sighs> Attention! Possible agitator presence detected near breach site. 56 minutes. Okay, let's do it. We got some moles to burn. The only good mole is a dead mole. Do I have any stims? Yes, I do. <laughs> ah, I'm broke. Okay. Oh, Miner's Key, that sounds important. I don't know what for, but it sounds important. I gotta say, we've been getting some good leveling going tonight, though. Very, very good leveling. Is this like a main miscellaneous quest that it's trying to give me, or is this like... Hey, Dan, I hate when this game pops up quests on your screen and you're like, fuck, I am doing stuff. <laughs> you know what I mean? You're just like, I don't really want to do this right now. You're just like, hey, do this miscellaneous quest, and then it like distracts you. Because this game has like a really bad habit of like putting lots of things on your screen, but you're like, where am I actually going? And it's like taking you somewhere you're not supposed to go. Clear the area of hostiles. 
Uh, so we need more of these minor mole men. Remember, the only good mole person is a dead mole person. Are they here? I don't see any more of the mole people. You gotta be around here somewhere. We've only got 53 minutes to kill them. You got your six shooter? You're the ghoul? I love how they call him the ghoul. He's not a ghoul. He's the ghoul. Retreat to a safe distance? What does that mean? Is this gonna blow up? I've only got six seconds to get over there. I I I don't I think I'm not in a safe area. Oh we're we're good. Is there anything else that's going on here? Harvest materials from containers. Where? Here? Harvest material from containers, like, in this area? Or? Harvest material from containers. Oh, from these containers, okay. I don't see any materials. Well, he took all the materials, that's funny. Yeah, you, you took all the materials so I can't finish my challenge, you little fucker. <sighs> so now I have to kill all the mole people. Thanks a lot, Filet. Fuck. And I'm over encumbered, so I can't do anything. I don't have any stims. I don't even have any stims for myself. You're punching me? Oh my god. I'm out of ammo. Fuck, this game is so tedious, dude. I do have a stim for myself. Good for me. Good for me. There's another guy here. Oh, well, it's counting has progressed. Now we have uh, 22 out of 30. Maybe it is counting. I don't know. Is there another area where we're collecting supplies from? Yes, yeah, that's 22 out of 30 now for supplies, unless there's. Oh my god, now my fucking inventory is over encumbered again. Oh my god. Seriously, it's, it's fucking tiring. It's like constantly you're just like. Over encumbered. You have too much stuff. You don't have any ammo. You it's like holy it's, it's like they made Fallout tedious. It's it's killing me. It's killing me. Yeah, maybe it did count that Filet picked that stuff up. I I don't know. This is twenty seven out of thirty, so maybe it's a team effort? I d I, I don't know. Collect away, I guess. Oh, this container has stuff, but I'm getting attacked by mole fuckers. <laughs> that didn't count as anything harvesting stuff. I, I don't know how this works. Never played a Fallout game? They're really good. I mean, this isn't your traditional Fallout game, but... Whoa, yeah, they're pretty cool. I don't know how this works. So only some stuff counts as being collected, and other stuff doesn't. I, just, I don't understand this. Maybe from the top of this thing. Oh, 
Collect remaining materials before the machine submerges. Okay. I got no ammo again. <laughs> they don't give me enough fuel back. Where'd that other guy go? Wasn't there like a third dude here with him? Took every scrap of resources I had to make enough ammo just for a thousand shots. Killer, eh? We did it! I got the achievement! I'm respawning back at base. Yes! High fives all around. Now the only event I need to do is this, uh... Monster Mash. I don't know where that is. Complete Recruitment Brew Blues. Heart of the Enemy, Bunker Buster, one of us. I wonder if I have any of these. Yeah! We achieve filet and we achieve more with your guys' likes on the stream. To be able to, sh or be sure to be able to like the stream and all that stuff. I mean, it's a really easy thing to do, I've heard. Really easy. And fun-ish. Yeah. I'm over-encumbered again. <laughs> you fucking kill me, Gabe. What am I not over encumbered? Oh, it's because I got all this missile crap. Oh my god, stop. <laughs> I don't even know what you do with this ore stuff. That's actually pretty good. The missile launcher I do not need. Level 50, actually, what is the missile launcher I have in my inventory rated at? Level 40. Alright, well, I'll take that and then I'll put this other missile launcher in here. All right, let's see what else there is. Is the Monster Mash... You know, I swear I've seen the Monster Mash as, like, an event you can do a dozen times, and I've never done it, because I didn't realize it was an achievement. It's kind of hilarious, isn't it? He did the mash. He did the Monster Mash. Or is the Monster Mash only, like, a festive Halloween kind of thing? Yeah, I don't think it's radiation rumble. What are these guys doing? Blah blah man. They're at Flay's custom marker. Well, I guess we can see what kind of main quests we have and maybe knock one of those off would be kind of cool and easy, I think, right? Find the Fort Defiance location. Okay, where's Fort Defiance on the map? Does anyone know where Fort Defiance is? Is that it? Radiation rumble, Solomon's pump. It is like so hard to find where crap is. Fort Defiance. I know I'm supposed to find Fort Defiance, but oh, okay. Find the location Fort Defiance. I don't have anything close to that that I can like fast travel to? Oh my god, Valet for I guess the Kerwood mine is like the closest? Okay. Let's go and check it out. Yeah. You know what? I don't even think I've liked the stream. <laughs> yeah, they've got this this new stupid YouTube UI for desktop is so awful. Like it's it's just the dumbest thing in the world. Uh, okay, so we're going to Fort Defiance, which is this way. Yeah, it's this way. Okay. I think we have a little bit of a map. 
Country roads, take me home to the place that Bug Snacks belongs. West Virginia and all that stuff. So I'm level 68. Is the achievement for level 100? Level 100. Oh my god. This would actually be a great weekend to just grind. Like, I think if I sat here one of these days and I just kind of joined an expeditions team, I could just power level, right? Theoretically. Firebase Major. Oh, that's not what we're wanting to go to. Fort Defiance. Just wondering if I want to spend a lot of time doing, like, a quest tonight or not. Like, I don't know how much work this is. Defiance has fallen. Is this an achievement? I don't know if this one is. I think this was part of the original storyline where there's just not a whole lot to it. Fucking crevices, dude. Why is this design like this? Hey, look, Filet's over there. Doing this thing. Let's find this creepy fort. Out here in the middle of this forest. Is my character thirsty? Am I thirsty? Oh, it's food that's always the problem. Yeah, there's never any, like, food to eat. I always just have drinks. I've got, like, hundreds and hundreds of bottles of water. Which doesn't wear me down, like, weigh me down, but, like, you know, everything else does. Which is hilarious. But not hundreds of bottles of water. Water is overabundant. Is this the fort we're looking for? Ah, let's go take a look. No, this is actually a fort. And there are really scorched monsters in there. I wonder if we could, like, sneak up the side. Ah, we found the fort, right? Yeah, that is a strangely high decorated sign. It's pretty clean. I think we gotta go inside this building. I'm hoping they don't notice us, but now that I'm getting shot, I'm saying yes, they do know that we're here. Oh crap, and they know how to use guns. I forgot the Scorch know how to use guns. Do I have access to this? Salt the Quartermaster. Scorched Conqueror? That's pretty cool. He use like 80, 100 bullets, and it's like that guy just takes shots like that. What is that down there? That's where the password is? Filet, get the password! Dirty water, I got tons of fresh water. No. Oh. The hell is this quartermaster thing at? Is it like buried underground? Oh, that's where the ghouls are. Of course it is. Of course it's where the ghouls are. Why wouldn't it be where the ghouls are? diluted. Of course it's in a creepy basement. Oh, that was easy. That perfectly opened. Hmm. I thought there'd be more work involved in that. Well, there's just rad stuff. Only the secure storage key can open this. You gotta be fucking funny. Dude. The secure storage key. Well, where do I get the secure storage key? Drink this whiskey. Only the storage key. Where is the storage key? <sighs> I 
I should only be allowed the storage key. Yeah, but where, where is the storage key at? This is what I was talking about what pissed me off so much when this game launched, is these quests were just kind of like, straight up like fucking fetch quests over and over again. Uh, back up there. Of course it is, so I gotta run back up the cliff to grab the item. This is what you did, like when the game first came out, like these were kind of the quests. You would like listen to an audio tape and then you'd wander from one like mindless area to the next mindless area. That was like the whole story structure. He's the ghoul, but he's not ghouled enough. You had to go find the password fillet, so you had to go to one thing to one thing. It is, it is, literally, it was just like ridiculous fetch quests, and it was just silence. It was the weirdest game in the world. It was like, the best part I had was like the hour I played with, uh, with Mitchell, because he got it as well, and we did like some cooperative stuff. We were both sitting there kind of being like this, just like... There's something off about this, if that makes sense. Yeah. Because it was, it was just empty. It was like, they built, like, probably the most expansive, best, like, Fallout world ever. Like, the map is amazingly massive. And so filled with crap. But, like, it was just empty. There was no NPCs, there's no quests. Yeah, it was just audio log quests. It was just, it was super lame. No NPCs, you're just like fighting monsters and stuff. It really didn't make any sense at all. Do we have to use the terminal or? And then it just gave you a bunch of crap. You always got just a bunch of food crap, basically. Get inside the headquarters of the Brotherhood. Where's that at? They took their training and their call signs seriously. That's for certain. Organized, efficient, access to hardware. You'd think they'd be rooting with Virginia by now. But they're gone. If they're following military logic, then they'll have a fortified headquarters somewhere. And a leader. Someone who knew what they were planning. At least this guy's got a camp right near the Brotherhood. No, seriously though, it was just like, literally like, audio log quest after audio log, it was so weird. I was wondering if any of these achievements we could like, easily get, but... I, I think these these quests would lead to those quests, if that makes sense. It's like a chain of crap. <laughs> yeah, it's like a chain of crap you had to do. Yeah, I, I like... I don't mind it in Fallout, but it's just like this was the whole game was just doing this. Am I stuck here? Okay, there we go. I was like, what the hell? Anyways, let's see what this guy's got in his house. Yeah. Like, look at this. I haven't even been here before. Like, there's so many places in this game. And I've, I've traveled, like, for hours and hours and hours and hours. And, um... Uh, there's still so much stuff I haven't seen yet, which I love. Same with Fallout 4. I've, I've played a fucking ton of Fallout 4. And there's still stuff in that game to see, which is cool. I love Nuka World. But yeah, this like the whole game being like this was such a dumb, dumb decision. Okay, well how the hell do you get in here? I guess there's some kind of like awkward side thing you get into. Yeah, it's, it's cool. You go to, like, vaults and stuff. Like, sometimes it's fun to piece together what was left behind, but the whole game just being, like, you following in the footsteps of, like, some annoying-ass overseer that you don't even care about was just crazy. What the f- where the fuck is the entrance? Oh, it's over this way? It was 50 meters. I, don't, I didn't see a door over here. Hmm. Yeah, it's not a door. Well, how do you how do you get into this place? Blade, do you have an entrance? This is 
like a back door we get in on? And then I, th I think it's pretty funny too that like, I think this game ultimately ends up being a story where you're just like literally fighting the ripped off dragon from Skyrim that they they threw into this, like just copied and pasted, which I thought was so weird. Yeah, like the Scorch Mother or whatever, it's just he uses the same dragon animation and everything, it's just like, what? Like how did they think they could get away with that? People wouldn't notice. <laughs> Especially with how much people play Skyrim, it's like, really? Power offline. Shocker. Okay, so where do we go to turn on the bunker lights and or power and stuff? Is that even over this way, or am I going like way out of the way? I assume we have to go up, or yeah, we gotta go up. Holy crap! Am I dying like fucking crazy? And I'm out of stims. Cough, like. It's, it's so weird because you're just like, you're constantly out of stuff in this game. Just constantly. <sighs> I mean, we don't know for sure what the uh, the resolution performance is going to be for the next... I'm going to take the garden now. The Fallout 4 update. Your, your guess is as good as mine. Oh. <sighs> It's just like, it's kind of a drag doing this. Oh my god, there's so many fucking feral ghouls, man. Do you imagine streaming this, like, at the launch? I wish I would have been doing streaming at the time, because it would have been funny just sitting here being like, what is this? Because I remember working on my review for it being like, what is this nonsense? My buddy Mark was played the ton out of this one, you know, just to play it and stuff, and he was, like, way ahead of me, and I just kind of gave up. I was like, this is horrendous. Yeah, I'm on the third level now. Hmm. Yeah, this is like, I do think fundamentally other people is what makes Fallout, if that makes sense. Like NPCs, characters, stuff, like people you interact with. Uh, like NPCs and that just like literally make this experience what it is. Fuck me. Oh God. <laughs> I'm all the way at the beginning! Why? 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 You do this to me. Why? <laughs> uh, why? I know I need rat away. This time with feeling. Because, yeah, a lot of it, it just felt like quiet, like, kind of walking and stuff, which was not the feeling you want from, like, a Fallout game. There we go. There we are. Let's grab the weird notepad. Take the elevator to the top floor. I can do that. Now I'm over encumbered because of the crap it gave me. And now I'm getting killed. Because of the crap it gave me. Fucking Christ, there's a glowing Wendango. Could have at least given me some stim packs or something. This thing's actually terrifying. 
Where's Philea? You're supposed to be coming and taking these guys. You're supposed to be taking the hits for me. And you guys are supposed to be hitting me up with your likes on the stream. Subscribing's great. Donation's cool. Be the channel member you want to be. Why do I have this? I thought I put that away. No? Fuck me, man. A scribe outfit? Why would I have a scribe outfit? Okay, there we go. Okay, well, how do I enter this elevator? Or do I have to kill the Wendango to enter it? Is that the problem here? Let's all kill it. I'll kill this thing. I'm suffering from sludge lung. A new casual team has been created. Find a place, register for elevator security. Recruitment blues, that's the one we want to do. Okay, so recruitment blues is what we want because that's an achievement. Okay, so how do we turn off this other quest? The technical forbidden knowledge, but where the fuck is forbidden knowledge? Okay, register for security. Fucking Christ. <sighs> ah. Well, how do I get up there? I gotta. Do I have to walk back to the fucking place I just walked? Or do I go this way? Oh, Filet left the team? Oh, okay. That makes more sense now. Got it. <sighs> God, this game's depressing. Okay, well, how do I get over there? Do I have to do a long, convoluted, kind of walk-around sort of thing? You don't feel this with other Fallout games. It's specifically this one that has the setup where it's just kind of, like, a little sad to play. And it's like, I'm sure a lot of people spend a lot of time working on this, and it's just like, I feel like adding NPCs and stuff would have been like one of the easier parts, but something that would have been time constraining and yeah, I think it would have made such a better stuff or such a better game. Search for clues. Where are the clues at? Nearby, but not close, so oh, in here. Go to Camp Mint McClintlock? Where's Camp Mint Clint? Where, where the fuck is that? Where's, where's Camp McClintlock? All the way over here? Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> really? Is there nothing closer? The railroad? God damn it. <sighs> Fallout is depressing. It is too, from like a good story point, but also from like a... Like the melancholy of Fallout is nice, but it's just like, from a gameplay standpoint, it's like, what was the idea here? Yeah. Seriously, it's just like, what is this? What is this nonsense? Recruitment blues, ugh. Unbelievable. Alright, so let's go see what this is all about. Oh, this the town's kind of nice. I like actually I like this town. This is like I think the first town you go to in this game. Is is this one? I'm pretty sure. You no, know, I don't think I've ever gone to this side. 
of the town before, probably because of all the uh, the ghouls. <laughs> yeah, the ghouls are probably why. Use 400 bullets already. I've barely done it. Nothing. Nothing at all. Killer. The irony of being an expeditions team, not doing expeditions. It'd be like a ridiculously long, boring quest. I don't know if I, how I feel about this. Right, let's let's get up to the top and let's let's explore this camp and see what this is like. Start my training? Oh god, I don't want to train here. Who's got time for that? Sergeant Gutsy! That's kind of fun. Hmm, Sergeant Gutsy. So they got automated robots still patrolling here? That's interesting. Oh, I can't crawl in through one of the holes? Really? Oh, that's lame. Oh, but I can't go in through the roof. Equipped a set of fatigues. Alright, we're doing a quest from the robots. A hallucinogen gas canister? Okay. Where do I get a uniform from? Okay, I want to turn off the basic training. Or is this like, this is a main quest too. Like a voucher in the barracks, alrighty. This is about the barracks. I'm down for some army training with some freaking things. Are there 360 games? Nah, I, I'm at peace with what I've got from the 360 era in the, the digital store. Equipped an army helmet. Eat canned dog food. Yes, yum. I'm over encumbered? Again? Fuck me, dude. No, no. Equipped an army helmet. There's supposed to be a voucher in here? I don't see a voucher anywhere. Is it hiding? Okay, let's go hand this in, I guess. There's a fucking guy alive? Is that like a real player? What the hell? Equipped an army helmet. Do I have a helmet? Hey, this is U.S. Army property. Or what's left of it? The hell? Why is there an NPC in here? For preservation stuff. I mean, most of the 360 stuff will just be like emulatable now. Complete the marksman course. Oh, we're doing courses. Okay. Well, this is semi-interesting quest. The patriotism training course. All right, we'll start with that because it's right here. Let's learn about American patriotism. Way different from San Francisco. The winters are 
Good interrogate. I think it's Gian. I actually have to interrogate all of them. Oh God. My ancestors came over on the Mayflower. Okay. See again, just audio logs. My favorite holiday? Well, that would have to be the 4th of July. Well, yeah, my pop's in the union. Why do you ask? My terminal keeps me company while pop is at the mine. I needed a new password, so I used to <laughs> someone I admire a lot. Am I free to go? His password is needed. I do it. Nice. They can't keep getting away with it. targets. But you can't even shoot them from one area. It's like move around. Nice. The show, it had been the show has basically nothing to do with Fallout 76. Yeah, like nothing to do with this game. No, like I, I wouldn't say there's anything really to tie the two together except for the pack they added of like Vault 33 stuff to this game recently. This is rad water. That's even worse military training. Holy. Go, 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 go. Ah, uh, the U.S. Army has, like, really relaxed uh, training things, doesn't it? We got a minute left. We gotta go. At least this is a kind of interesting quest, I gotta say. Complete the live fire quest? Oh, there's a live fire thing? Okay. Well, this is kind of a. Uh, yeah. Good job, soldier, right? Yeah. Hmm. 
This is actually an interesting uh, quest in this game. I'm actually gonna like this. It's different, yeah. Wonder what I'm gonna have to kill? The robot? Commie bots? Eh, yeah, that's funny. It's actually kinda funny. Well, hopefully this goes well. I've only got 530 rounds, so, you know. Communist sympathizers, sympathizers, no. They turned the robots against us. I feel like you wouldn't even understand this stuff if you were someone from this time, because the military wouldn't even have existed probably for hundreds of years, right? Well, actually, no, this is right when the bombs drop, right? So I guess, is it a hundred years? Like 30, 40? I can't remember what the timeline is. But you still wouldn't really, well, I guess the vaults would kind of teach you about the military, I suppose, but, hmm. Because I try to think of the context of it, like regular people wouldn't really know what a military is after so long, right? It would just kind of... Be like an old concept. I don't even know if you could ever even have an effective military again after this much of the population's gone, right? Out of my low on health, I'm like a freaking one shot here. Oh, there's a stim. It's a good night when I leave the night with more stim packs and stuff than when I started it. That never happens in this game. Thank god I got like 200 self repair kits. I don't even know if I'd be able to play this game without all this stuff, you know what I mean, available to me. And your likes. I don't know what I'd be able to do without your likes. They they keep me grounded. Alright, well they can also take me higher. Perfectly good robots that are, like, impossible to make in this time. And we're destroying them. Isn't that kind of funny, though? Like, seriously, like, you'd never be able to craft these robots in this era. And we're just, like, wasting them. And I'm almost out of ammo. Time to report the sergeant. Let's see what he has to say. Hmm.
All right, let's do this. Well, well. My senses tell me you're not nearly as dead as I expected. Right? Impressive, cadet. Or should I say, private. You are now an official member of the United States Army. You yeah. Do us proud, soldier. You are dismissed. I have a government issued ID right on. Now what do I do with that? Did I go back to where I was? Oh, I have to go to the government building? Okay. I gotta get a government ID. Things you'll go to for gamer score. It's not even really worth it, right? How much is this 20 gamer score? I guess, like, honestly, is it even worth it? Like, ugh. I just, I kind of started the quest, so I'm like, maybe I should just do it, but like, I don't know what I'm getting out of this. I don't know. Something to do tonight, I guess. <sighs> This could have at least spawned me in the building. I guess I can take some rat away. <sighs> like a load screen to go to a load screen. Stat effect, you can see double XP is on. Well, that's what it's all about, is double XP, but I think it would have been more effective leveling-wise so I can finally get that level 100 achievement just to, like, literally keep doing expeditions, like joining lobbies and getting expeditions. The DMV terminal? You gotta be kidding me. in Apocalypse Lane. Patrons Thank God a DMV robot's still number. working. Wait for the automated number terminal to call their number before being serviced. Have a nice day. Patrons are required to take a number and wait for the automated number terminal to call their number before being serviced. Have a nice day. The laser minigun actually kills the invincible guys? Well, that's great. Turn an ID to, to B, okay. It's got like, wait for it to load, or what? Does it take a while, or? Turn. Oh, fuck right off. Come on. I don't have the ammo. charged. Yeah, that I have. <sighs> we just not. Like, could, could you just fuck off? Is that why this wasn't working?
Turn in application to Department B. C1. B. Patrons are required to take a number and wait for the automated number <laughs> to call them before being <laughs> Have a nice day. Like, when they were testing this game, did they think this was, like, a fucking good idea? Like, honestly. Like, did they actually think the gameplay design of this story was, like, good? <laughs> oh, not more. Please stop. Please stop. Just stop. Please fuck off. Oh my god, Bethesda, seriously. I have to get a postmarked letter? Oh, fucking god. What am I doing to myself? Why am I doing this? Like, seriously, why am I doing this? <laughs> like, I, don't, I don't even know sometimes. 50 meters away, I have to go and get a postmarked letter? Oh my god. Why? It's so bad. No, not more Scorch Wanderers. What, now I have to go up? Oh, come on. Oh, is that in the courthouse? Fuck me, man. Why did I do this? Why do I do this to myself? This isn't the way to go? Mm, ah. Okay, well, so do I have to go to the roof? Oh, my phone. What a dumb quest. The achievement ping is not even worth it. Fallout 3 in New Vegas. Well, Fallout 3, I'm waiting for the remaster. And Fallout New Vegas is one I wanted to have Kevin do at some point. But I feel like all of that stuff's just never gonna happen. Honestly, like I said, when I was doing, like, the housing thing today, and they are like, oh yeah. You know, it's just random luck if you get, like... The draw of being able to get like the the housing money it was just like luck, and I was just like, "Fuck me!" It's like I'm never reaching any of my goals. <laughs> this is really like just shitty. They're, like when they were testing this game, were they like, "Man, this is not good"? Like, did they think they had like a big hit on their hands with this like game? Like, what? Like, again, I, I like the later story stuff that they add, but, like, when you're taking a look at this shit, like, did they actually think people were gonna be, like, into this? Like, it's, like, a legitimate question. Like, because this is, like, one of the starter quests, and it's like this. It's just hot fucking garbage. <laughs> How do I get to this stupid thing? This way? Ugh. God, just leave me alone. Fucking, like, ugh. Like, we're doing a DMV quest? What the fuck? It just took me in a fucking circle? It just took me through the other part of the building? Like, what? What the f 
fuck? What the fuck? Is it? What? Oh, God. Acquire a postmark thing. It just takes you in a fucking loop. What a dumb piece of shit. Zoomed really tight on my map just west of the building. There's a very small circle. There's a mailbox to the right back corner of the courthouse. Mailbox. A mailbox in the bottom of the corner. A mailbox. Where is there a mailbox? There is a mailbox. What? What the f What? What? Right back corner of the corner. Go to the right of the building. Go to the right of the building. To the right of the building. There's apparently a mailbox. Please, ghouls, just stop fucking hitting me. Please, just leave me alone. There's a buried mailbox somewhere here. Ah, fucking dumb this game. This game's actually fucking dumb. Okay, there's a mailbox to the right back corner of the courthouse. If you leave the DMV, is this where it is? Because this is the DMV. Okay. And walk straight ahead. It, it, apparently there's a fucking mailbox somewhere. Is it this way? I'm over encumbered again. Fuck! Fuck this game, man. I'm over encumbered again. So there's like a mailbox somewhere? There's the junk mail. And now we go talk to the DMV thing again. Ugh, you gotta be kidding me, man. Ugh, why am I doing this? <laughs> Who designed this quest? It was probably more humorous in concept than it is in execution. Greetings, C-42. Mail identified. Scanning. Scanning. Does not match address on DMV AT 21C, Mr. Resident. Acquire DMV AT 21C B. Authorization from Charleston Courthouse. Have a nice day. <sighs> These quests fucking suck. I forgot how bad these quests are. And how fucking annoying it is getting attacked by fucking ghouls and stuff when you're just trying to play this stupid quest in this garbage, garbage main story. Here you go, robot. Greetings, C-42. Mail you know, unlike America, we don't have annoying ass fucking DMVs like this. I get what they're trying to do, but this is just so stupid.
MVAT21C-B. Recognized. Processing. Processing. All required paperwork for ID renewal is in order. Error. Department B is for renewals only. Department C is designated for new IDs. Have a nice day. Department C requires patron to requeue to be helped. Grab uh -huh. Wait in our well appointed lobby until it is called. Have a nice day. They probably thought they were so fucking clever doing this. Like, I bet there was some fucking idiot just sitting there being like, oh, this is so entertaining. People could laugh their asses off. Fucking stupid. Consult the helpful error assistance entries on the application terminal. Have a nice day. Overseer's log, Charleston Capital. If automation still rules West Virginia, then Charleston is the heart of the machine. Bureaucracy still pumping away without any people to serve. There's a lesson there. Now where do I have to fucking go? The governor's seal. The governor's seal. Okay, if I ever stream this again, again, remind me to never do these fucking main game quests because they are garbage. They are actually fucking garbage. Holy... What an embarrassment this game is. <laughs> what an embarrassment this is. Greetings. A3. Paperwork identified. Scanning. Scanning. Everything is in order. Proceed to the photography station to receive your government ID card. Have a nice day. Now, where do I register for the Brotherhood of Steel? So, to register for the so to be a part of the Brotherhood of Steel, you still have to be part of the U.S. military. How does that make any sense? Yeah, your sweet gun's really sweet until you run out of bullets, which you constantly do in this game. They sell bullets. Is that why it's like so hard to get them? Is like they sell them. Oh, don't forget to like the stream, guys. Oh, now we have to walk back into the building. Why do I do this to myself? Seriously.
Why do I do this? Oh yeah, I forgot. I gotta walk all the way up around to get to this thing. <laughs> this is like, it's it's just a fetch quest game. The whole game is just fetch quests. Fetch quest after fetch quest after fetch quest. Money. There's there's not enough money in this to make it worth all the time I spent doing this shit. It's like fuck. I'd way rather just do a regular work day, come home and just fucking sit around. Why would you have to scan a military ID to become a Brotherhood of Steel? Because there's no the government for you to get this stuff. Filet, why aren't you here with your thing to get this achievement? So if they have doors, the Brotherhood of Steel, that allow them to hide in the top parts of this building, how did they ever lose to the Scorched? Power armor? Too bad I don't have tons of that. Oh, remember when that scribe didn't love me from years back when we just streamed this? Use the Brotherhood transmission radio to find Taggarty. Where's that at? Alright, let's. We finished the quest. We got the achievement. Let's go home. I'm over encumbered, so I can't fast travel. Why? 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 Level 70. Nice. Take me home. Take me home, please. Ah, <sighs> the squire filet. Ugh, that's where it's at. Well, if I really feel the emotional motivation to sit here and grind out expeditions and get level 100, that would be pretty cool. And then I never have to think about leveling again in this. Say level thousand times. Holy crap. And then there's just these five quests. Mistress of Mystery. Oh, there's actually several more of these useless quests. Ugh. Ugh. My level was perfect. Yeah, I'm sorry from going from 69 up. <clears throat> that was hell. That was, like, mind-numbingly boring. This just reminds me when this game launched and you're just doing the same thing over and over again. Anyways, guys.